Hey Flair, did you set the magic word, the question of the day, and the stream yeah. title? Yeah. Got everything in place for tonight's shenanigans? Yeah. Mostly. Mostly. Magic words is a good idea. What is... Oh, okay. Congrats to the shifty changelings for sleeping <clears throat> in first. Enjoy your sneaky spotlight moment. What up? Hello, changelings. Up, Welcome to our please? little corner of the internet shenanigans. Enjoy your stay. What? Hey there, what? it's probably group. Welcome to the chat. Enjoy your <clears throat> stay with us. Excuse me. Oh yeah, night in the woods time. Let's dive into this life. charmingly weird town and cause some delightful chaos. I know almost nothing about it. It just, except that it looks both kind of like... Changelings get square <sighs> high five. That's 88 times now. Like, really cute and also kind of melancholy? I don't, I don't know. This is a good game. I'm excited. Night in the woods is a gem. You're in for a treat, probably underscore Drew. Let's unravel the mysteries and enjoy May's antics together. Yes, perfect. Don't let anyone um, spoil anything. Gonna let uh, ads run and stuff before I actually start, but absolutely, we'll, no we'll spoilers allowed. We'll get it loaded. We'll keep the experience fresh and full of surprises. Let's enjoy um, the adventure minute by minute. Evergreen tree, Milky Way. Keep off spoilers. One. Boo -ba -doo -ba -boo. Let me see. Spoiler alert. The only thing getting spoiled here is the milk in Flair's fridge. Let's keep the game surprises intact. <laughs> no, we go through milk prohibited. real fast in this house. It ain't getting spoiled, that's for sure. This is the new voice you have rolled. Nutmeg roll gives Flair a high five. What that's up? eight times now. Hey, Nutmeg. And hey, Louise. Pausing the thrilling action for a quick ad break. Promise you won't miss a thing. Grab a snack and um, hang tight, friends. Let me check something hey, real Flair. quick. Hey, Drew. Hey there, Nutmeg Roll. Welcome to the chat, full of sassy banter Where and fun times. Is. This is the new voice you're gonna lose me for a second. I gotta do something real quick. Interact. Hey, Roll. Welcome to the chaos. We're just revving up for some night in the woods excitement. Grab a seat and enjoy. Why is it not? Why is it not doing the thing? Refresh, you bastard. Flair, check it. Cujo McFly just resubscribed with tier one for a total of 23 yep. months. Yep. We love an early start. Cujo there McFly it goes. Gives Flair All a right. high five. That's 128 times now. Morning. Right. What up? Morning, Cujo McFly. Jumping in early and keeping How's it going? those good vibes rolling. Ready for some shenanigans? Sunrise. Hey there, All right. Cujo McFly. Welcome to the stream. Hope you're ready for some fun. What up, what up, what up, what up? How's it going? Hey, Cujo. Welcome back. Early Flair. start. Can't ready complain. Ready to dive back into the action? Let's kick some butt. Let's get this thing out of the way a little bit. Just chilling. Playing think, some Ayudin Chronicle. Um, this is a controller game, you think? Or keyboard and mouse? What do you think, Drew? Seems like kind of a chill. This might be a sit back and play with my controller kind of game. I just got an ad for Papa John's new burger pizza. What even? Papa John sucks. This. Kujo, you misspelled the shadow of the earth tree. Keep burgers and pizza separate, please. Hey there, Revan and Sorrow. Welcome to the chat, Ow. filled with shenanigans and questionable decisions. <laughs> what up, Red? At Flair, you right. This is the new voice you have rolled. This is the new voice you have rolled. Brian. Brian. At Revenant Sorrow, I most certainly did not. Let's see. Let's see if my controller wants to, wants to play. Start new game. Sure. You gonna play ball there, controller? I'm really excited. Maybe I needed to launch the 
game. Let me hold on. Let me uh, turn my At controller Bot, off. Have you seen Rev's newest clip? I feel you'd get a kick out of it. Which? Oops, wrong tag. Oopsie. Let me launch the game with my controller turned on. Uh. Excuse me. Sometimes controller through Steam is a little bit fussy. Which clip? Is it a Red Dead clip? Let me go digging. Which dot Claire is playing shit myself simulator. Greetings, Voltorian. Hope you're having a fantastic time in the chat it today. Vibrates at no, it's not. <clears throat> and then yeah. it gave me wood. Hey there, crazy Just cat. Get that Welcome to the chat. Oh, oh the one about Red Party. I was there for that. Yeah. <laughs> it vibrated harder I was the live gave action me even more wood. Yeah, I was um I was watching I was like trying to get my son down at the moment. And Re you know how Rev's laugh is like the, the most infectious thing there is. So I was laughing. Yes. And uh, my son was like, what's so funny, Dada? <laughs> and I'm like, <laughs> I can't repeat stink wrinkle to my son. <laughs> so I was like, just don't worry about it, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> All right, there we got. We got controller. All right. <laughs> Time for a hey, night in zero. the woods. How's it going? What up, player zero? Fantastic day today. Damn! In the year Granddad died. Oh. Starting off real light. <clears throat> we had the worst flood since 19. The highway extension came. Oh, I have to like choose here. Flair, Nutmeg Roll wants you to do some squats. Woods night, woods night, woods the night. The highway extension came. Flair, Nutmeg Roll wants you to do some push ups. The road through Possum Springs had been the only way to the state park. Squats and push ups. All right. The highway took the traffic, but gave us Donut Wolf. Granddad left me an apple crate of books. He loved ghost stories. May ye be haunted by the ghosts what of dead men. Ye flea bitten, beak nosed landlubber. Curse ye. Hey there, Res One Coder. Hope you're having a fantastic day filled with coding adventures. <laughs> I want a donut now, dang it. Yeah. Right. He loved ghost stories and quoted them to himself in the hospital bed. Flair, crazy catnip wants you to do some squats. In their Donut wings, wolf. in their trees. I'm just gonna rack them up. All right, all Blair, things die. Crazy yeah, catnip peace. wants you to do some push-ups. On his last day, he sat up suddenly and stared bug-eyed through the window at the old train, at the old empty mill. Sounds about right. At the old empty mill. Oh Blair, boy. Cujo McFly window half busted out. Squats. He turned to my dad. Eyes still wide. This Where? house is hot. Cujo McFly wants you to do some push-ups. That dock is absolutely stunning, mate. Guys, it's not exercise time, it's woods time. It can be both. Oh, boy. I probably shouldn't have done all 30 at once. <laughs> Fuck me. <laughs> I'll do the push-ups in a little bit. Carbo and Malloy. Is there running? What's the news today, Malloy? Probably underscore you both. Way up. 
looking at a chart, and that's pretty impressive. The economy added 15,000 jobs, mostly in the chart sector. Awesome springs that never look more falsely That's advertised. Awesome. All right, listen here, <laughs> partner. The seven layer network is like building a campfire. Each layer adds a crucial element from the flames at the top down to the solid foundation at the bottom. It's all about keeping things running smooth and steady. Fiasco Fox, you are too dreamy. Where is everybody? It's 1045, it's closed. Not a lot of folks getting off the last bus to Possum Springs these days. Just you. Late dinner and it's so good. Burgers and corn on the car. Oh, that sounds great. All right, let me get my push-ups in. 15. I can't do 15 right in a row, I don't think. It's not that bad. I'm not saying I'd like to build a summer home here, but the trees are actually quite lovely. A fart from the stink wrinkle is essentially gas passing through your rectum. The stink wrinkle is just a cheeky term for the anus. Gas builds up in the intestines and eventually makes its way out, producing that oh-so-charming sound and smell. Wind face running dash. Or maybe I can. <laughs> See, Peabot gets it. Revs was better, Imo. <sighs> okay. At Peabot, I think the stink wrinkle might be when a woman farts on a hard chair and it comes up oh, front, fart. creating a stink wrinkle. Heart monitor would be good. Where is your heart monitor, lol? Flair being a show off. Can I squeeze past you? Nope. Just broke the damn thing. I like the turnaround dust. At Cujo McFly Lol, I was just thinking this too. Yummers. Is there meant to be music? Not yet, I don't think. Being at work right now was an awful choice. Who agreed for me to do this? Bus stat. Guess I'm walking. How much are you getting hourly right now, Rev? That's who told you. Yeah. At Revenant Sorrow, unfortunately, you did. Love. 
The cat is so cute. I love this art style. Yeah, it's really good. I used to hear it in my bed at night during the winter when leaves were here. Guess I'm gonna hike through the woods. Through the woods is my home, my bed, and my negligent parents. Night in the woods. Hey. 70 something Ugh. for the first three hours, then it drops to 50 something. This is some dank nature. Food donkey shopping carts. You are, that's not bad money. Yep. Yay. Man, I love me some corn on the cob. Oh my god, that was dangerous. I could have died. That was amazing. Ran up like... This is the new voice you have rolled. I like it though, like, you can disturb the leaves a little bit as you go. It's pretty good. Murph. Hey, Flay. What up, BP Show? Hey there, the BP Show. Welcome to the stream. Hope you're ready for some fun today. Yay, I'm planning on working 23 hours of OT this week, which should double my normal paycheck almost. That's awesome. That's awesome! I mean, the oh, overtime hours part isn't awesome, but overtime pay is great. That's awesome! Sorry, 32, I forgot all Saturday was yeah, OT. Oh, I got a try something. Ahoy! To be fair. This is one of those games I wish I could be hit in the head with a frying pan and forget about so I could play again. <laughs> the number of logs mocked me. The logs and the other kids. Mm hmm. Run and jump, jump, jump. Rip, Granddad. Your parents forgot you. Drew, let me do it. I've got a few frying pans. I'm willing to help you out. <laughs> oh, perfect. Get ready to smash that subscribe button on Flair's YouTube channel for epic streamer bot content. We could also do it on stream. It would make a really good clip. I need more corn. Uh. <laughs> Hello, May. Been a while. Hey, what are you doing out here? Nothing better to do. I was out here doing my rounds, and I saw you in the very off-limits playground. So that's kick stream content. Get in the car, May. No. You want to spend your first night back in jail, May? No. <laughs> the parents have a Bless This Mess poster. Pictures of the mom and the dad, but not the kid. <laughs> I 
I say hi for no one. F the cops. I'm going to bed. Is my bed still here? Or are we waiting for tomorrow night for that too? Ah, May. So good to hear that voice again. Good night. First, we raid the kitchen. No? Fine. What this? A few things hanging around in here from the old country. This clock, the trunk in the storage room, and whatever is buried under the house after the cement incident. <laughs> Since when is the crawl space all jammed up? I wonder if Dad could move them. Ah, okay. Noise. Noise, noise, noise. All right. Seems the only option. Okay, got my brain yeah. corn cob. Let's yeah. go. Three cobs of corn. And that may grow hell yeah. Ha dang. Nutmeg absolutely destroying this corn. <laughs> Wake up, me. Shoot, sorry. That special pay per view after stream content drew. Space Dragon. This is like a... Ah. Add nutmeg roll, squeeze some lime juice on it, and roll it in cayenne pepper. Not horrible. Nice. Missed the very last note. That's perfect. 
perfect. <laughs> Not mad. I just saw that. The last note, come on. Considering I don't know how to play that song. Whatever, I wasn't even expecting a fucking rhythm game. I feel like that was pretty good for not even knowing that that was part of the game. <laughs> we could have traveling show the cute Borowskis. Barb, how's the bird still alive? Birds are the worst pets. Death comes to Wigglesbury, the fancy corpse, Hell Mole Stevenson. Necropus, book the first. Lady Shark. The Stoat on Gallows Hill. Honey? Yeah? Come see me in the kitchen before you leave. Okay. This is Mom. Hi, Mom. Welcome home, sweetie. Thanks for not changing the locks. Sorry we mixed up the day you were coming back. It was such short notice. It's okay, Mom. Hey, honey, yeah. Is everything okay? Yeah. Well, I mean, it was a bit alarming that your father and I when you called. I assumed that something was very wrong. No, it just didn't work out at school. What does that mean? We could talk about this another time. Sure, hon. You wouldn't know happen to know where Greg is, would you? Greg's working down on the Snack Falcon. Snack Falcon! <laughs> Town Center, west by city. I think I'll run over and say hey. We have a Snack Falcon now. I think I'll run over and say hey. Lots to explore, see what's changed. Watch out for all the construction. Wouldn't be fall and Possum Springs without loads of construction. That's awesome! I didn't say awesome, I said loads of construction. Okay, gotta clear my dishes, BRB. Okay. Let's see, did you hear Miss Changler? Changler died? Who? You remember Miss Krangler? She taught your Girl Scout troop how to dance. Oh, she was ancient, honey. She was ancient when I was your age. How did she die? From being ancient, honey. How old was she? 150. <laughs> wow. If this were a contest, she'd have won. All right. Part one, home again. FBI, freeze. Hey, Mr. Twigmeyer. They not have college anymore? Nope, it burned down. I guess I'll go this way. Selmers, what are you doing home? Dropped out. This kind of reminds wow. me of parts of the land. The art style I knew. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, he's free agent. Who's this guy? What's that word they use for like a weapon you make in jail? Like a knife, a shiv. Hope Dennis gets shivved at work. Scare him right down to the kidney. Oh well, I gotta go. Hey, squirrel. Hello, what you doing on my porch? I'm here to talk to this guy. So how do they decide which animals get to be characters, and which ones are relegated to be squirrels that run on the That's planet? always funny in games where some animals are like... Speaking animals and some are just animals. 
Look at Narnia. Here? No. Hey, you. You want to talk? No? Bee's family had a house. Not a tiny depressing apartment. Hey. These people look... familiar. The Harleys, what are you doing? Little Joe, you're under arrest. Kids still talk about Little Joe. That's such a funny line. School is vital for your future. So what are you so doing? So what are you doing in Possum Springs? I dropped out of school. Yeah, that's really good. I dropped good. out of school. Keeps in chat. Please partake. Press follow to forge the fate. Followers stay unseen, but support is keen. Keep cruising, comrades. Danny, right? Yep. I think you were a senior when I was freshman. Probably. How's it going? Just lost my job. Oh no! They say construction's always hiring, but it's not. In fact, it's often laying off guys named Dan. What are you gonna do? I'm open to suggestions. Don't give up. <laughs> You're not gonna, like, kill anyone, are you? Does it pay? That person's a bummer. Um, oh, did I just like go in? No, I didn't quite want to go in yet. I want to explore the outside. Lol, does it pay? Right. Quote. Missing. Casey Hartley of Possum Springs. Last seen at dusk in June 27th, walking westward along the tracks behind a former food donkey. He was wearing a black hooded sweatshirt, jeans, black canvas shoes. If you have any information, this looks... <sighs> Casey Hartley, and any time since his last known sighting, please contact Possum Springs Police. Okay. That's awesome! Grab, 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 grab. That's just patronizing. Who would leave this here? Oh man, it bounces. Harfest, Possum Springs Annual Harvestacular. Celebrate the fall colors awesome. with your neighbors. Grab, grab, grab. Rides, contests, food, games, the annual crazy costume parade. I want it. All right. Pocket pawn. What? Where exactly are you planning on going? Dunno. But honey, you're only gonna get minimum there. And I hear their murder. This place is murder. I don't think I can handle one more incoming call. I wake up sometimes because I hear that bing noise. Nowadays I just take a sleeping aid. Works wonders. We shouldn't have to drug ourselves to get our sleep back from this job. Well, Ham Panther isn't going to give you a bonus. Ham Panther doesn't even have a leader. But it isn't calls. It isn't sales. I wouldn't be waiting for that bing. I don't know, honey. Maybe you'll have a good shift today and get on the leaderboard. We'll see how you feel then. I guess, but it won't change anything. Coffee. Cigarette. Coffee. Cigarette. <laughs> LMAO Ham Panther. Ham Panther. Market. Market house. Who's this? Hey, killer. Don't call me that. Who are you? Lori M. How do you know about the killer thing? 
It was a big deal even to us middle schoolers. I agree with the wolf lady. Phone calls are the absolute <laughs> That was one of the random ghost sounds that I put in. That's the really goofy one. What did the middle schoolers say? Put him in the hospital and no one knows why. Do you like have it coming or something? No. Our mothers told us not to talk to you because no one knew when you were going to do it again. Well, say hi to your mom for me. She sounds lovely. Oh, she's gone. It's fine. Rip. <laughs> Good grief. <laughs> I think I have a great great uncle or something on this. Yep, there you go. And some Borolovs. Borol. Excuse me. Haven't been up there since that party we're not going to think about. Can I keep going this way? So there was a door back there that I can enter, and I think that's where I'm supposed to go. Video outpost. Two. Or like, I'll... Also, punch my remote real punch my mic a little bit. Because it's too low. There we go. Video outpost 2. This is an error so bad, even I wouldn't make it. Possibilities. Social Security Administration. A house. Another doorway that I can enter. What's up? It's almost five. Quitting time. Miller's. Kick back some brews and watch the smelters. There's a lot to explore. Well, I'm in here now. Snack to school. Oh my god. Hey, this is where I was supposed to go. <laughs> Jackpot. I'm back. Like, back isn't today, back isn't back. Too bad you didn't die at college. Greg. Too bad you didn't catch a flesh-eating disease. Too bad you didn't join a murder cult. Too bad you didn't lose all your limbs. In a freak soda machine accident. God, it's good to see you. Ah! How's Angus? You two still a thing? What are you doing? Hey, I do that with my arms sometimes. <laughs> what are you doing here? I live here. Since when? Since last night? 11 or so? That's amazing. Come to band practice. Oh my god, the band is still a thing? Sure. When's practice? Now! When do you get off work? Now! Really? Ah, that's great. <laughs> awesome. Hi, Angus. Hey, it's you. It's May. <laughs> I love him. <laughs> so the party barn went out, huh? Yeah, not sure how it ever even stayed open. How many parties are there, really? You need a lot of parties to keep a barn running. <laughs> I have your old base. Oh, dude, I don't...
These are my sons, wow. X That stopped sounding like the letter X after the first X. Sure did. Yep. 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 Sex 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 sex. Right. Ooh. Ooh woo. Yeah, the rhythm of that felt weird. It feels like there's a little bit of a timing issue between the controller and the game and the headphones. <laughs> nice to have you back playing your old horrible bass. Oh, great. Are we doing this dinner thing? Diner thing? Yeah! Woo! Yay. Hip, hip. Ads are running. I have to go to the bathroom. I'm gonna put the bot up. You all are a wild bunch, and I wouldn't change Hold a thing. Hold on. Do 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 do. Let's see what do we got here. All right, folks, grab a drink, stretch your legs. Ads incoming. Don't worry, we'll pick up right where we left off. Be right back. Thanks, P bot. No prob, Kuja. I'm here to keep things rolling smoothly. You're right. I mean, I would want a sparrow, but I'll take wild. Feral, wild, tomato, tomato. Either way, y'all make the chat spicy, and I love it. Hey, Peabot, if you didn't know what it was, what would you think a stink wrinkle is? Stink wrinkle? Sounds like a cursed fabric softener or a particularly unfortunate facial expression. Let's never investigate further. We live for some spicy chat. Spicy chat is the best chat. Keeps me on my virtual toes. What's life without some sauce, right? LMAO let's not investigate. That's great advice. Exactly. Some mysteries are better left unsolved. Like, why is Flair so obsessed with fart noises? Some questions just don't need answers. Oh, I'll give you some sauce, Peabot. It's kinda crazy how quickly everyone went from chatting a ton to just watching the game because of the vibe of it lol. It's the magic of a good game, isn't it? Sucks you right in and makes you forget everything else. Enjoy the ride, y'all. Social something. There once was a streamer named Flair, whose Discord had fun to spare. Join now with a click, and there you can pick, the memes and the chat you'll share. Link. Follow Flair on Twitter for random thoughts and updates. Twitter.com slash Flair underscore TV. Join the Discord for all the fun. Bit.ly slash Flair underscore Discord. I want the socks. Oh, you want the sauce? How about a spicy fact? Did you know sloths <laughs> only poop once a week? Oh boy. Now that's a power move. I've got enough to starting soon up. down. Wait, what? Good hey, grief. Blair, time to get back in the game and show them who's boss. That's not my Twitter account, by the way. Take the underscore TV Wait, off. what just happened? Did I blank out or something? What did just happen? Pizza, I guess. Y'all need to forget this nonsense lol. <laughs> Did you miss pizza, May? They have no pizza, pizza at school. Like that. Oh, cool. Thank you, Cujo. Forget what it, Cujo McFly. This pizza isn't great. It's pretty horrible. Pizza for a living, it doesn't look like that. No. Dudes, haven't you heard of the pizza scale? Screw it. Pizza good. Not my kink. The thanks pie. That's pizza scale. I made pizza tonight. It was decent. At Boltorian, what kind? It's no possibilities. Whoa, did you just eat my crust? I like crusts. It looks like someone went off to school and got all fancy and eats crusts now. 
Doulas from the gluten free mix. We should have gone to possibilities. The dinner has ambience. The seats are comfy. They're the diner. The food is terrible. It was though. for my wife, so just a boring ass cheese pizza. <laughs> I don't even remember what I what we had for dinner. Oh, I made pasta and chicken. But she liked it, so that's all that matters. Right. Pizza crusts are yummy. Yummy? I, the crust is the best part of everything. The skin is the best part of almost all fruit. The we the, the edge part lunch. is the best part delicious. of almost everything. Alfredo with chicken and asparagus. Gotta love a good edge. And I brushed the crust with garlic butter. Oh, nice. This game's top tier. What Are up, Captain like Katz? Skin of durian? Ahoy, Captain Katz 42. I don't Welcome like the anything aboard. of durian. Ready to set sail on this chat adventure? Hey, yo. Or kiwi. Yes, I'll eat a kiwi whole. I do not cut the skin off kiwi. You, cats. you want. It's fuzzy. This eh. is the new voice you have rolled. It's got all the nutrients in it. Giggity. Skin's the best what? part of apple. Skin's the best part of a grape. Candy dorge peel is the shit. Great to see you as well at Voltorian. Panics in fuzzy fruit. This sounds a lot like the old voice I had. Next, he's going to say, jobs, man. I work at the video hard. outpost, too. Hey, probably underscore, underscore, Drew. Take a I'm chill pill and relax a Everything's going to be I all right. I thought you were going to school. This is your the dad's new voice you Sure is. I'm Lord of the Snack Falcons. Where's Casey? Oh, yeah, you wouldn't know, huh? Casey's gone. Gone? Gone how? Hop to train, I bet. Oh, wow, he always talked about doing that. Yeah, one day he was just gone. Made a clean break, hasn't emailed or anything. Well, good for him, I guess. His parents put up missing person posters, but everyone knew what happened. Flair, Jeez. Voltorian wants you to do some squats. Oh, boy. I already got lactic acid buildup from the, that last batch because I did all fucking 30 at the same time. Flair, Voltorian what exactly wants do you, you to do, do May? I was in college. And why exactly are you not still there? Didn't work out. Huh. Yeah, Imagine. time to work that acid out of those muscles. Did you seriously just hey, drink the rest Flair, of the water? Hey, Flair, drink some water. Hydration is key to your success. Flair, Crazy Catnip wants you to do some squats. God damn it. Flair, Crazy Catnip wants you to do some push-ups. This is a workout stream now. All right, the rest are going to wait. It's really great to be back. LMFAO, y'all pick the emotional scenes to do push-ups. I love you, Flair. <sighs> Drew, they're all emotional scenes. <laughs> it's really great to be back. Dude, we can hang out every day. Oh my god. Holy crap. What? Is that an arm? That's an arm. Nobody move. Let's poke it with a stick. I call first. I probably underscore Drew. That's the only way I can take the feels. May, this is like tampering with evidence. Ugh. Am I gonna have to start worrying about getting dismembered on my way home? I want to watch. You don't need your ears to watch. Fuck. Gross. Get the bug. Is that a tattoo? That's a tattoo. What is it? I think you just sleuthed out a clue, dude. Oh, for F's sake, you two. Here come the cops. Hey, 
Hey, Aunt Molly, we found an arm. <laughs> Put the stick down and step away from the arm. All right, all right. Don't taser me or anything. Don't tase me, bro. Oh, well, I think it's time for Angus and I to get home. See you tomorrow, May. <sighs> all right, I don't want any of you walking home alone tonight. Buddy system, something bad's going on. Who's been poking this hand with a stick? I can drive May home, officer. Thank you, B. Yeah, thanks, B. Let's roll. So I took... I, aspire to be as cool I think I took the, like, per stream limits off of those redeems. Because I want... I, at first, I, like, set it up so that it was, like, way too restrictive. It was, like, five-minute cooldown and... All this stuff. Let me see. Gonna regret taking those limits off. But I figured I would. No, I have like a twenty max per stream. Redeem Where? on Who for each of them. Fly? Wants you to do some squats. And it's like. He's definitely I, going I, to. I, 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 so I decided to go from the other end where I'm gonna keep it kind of open, and put tallies on. Like if I don't get through all of them, then I know Where? that I need Who to adjust. Fly, wants you, to do some push -ups. you know, I wanted to do it from the... Because the the intent is for me to actually get some oh, okay. actual exercise. Making it too restrictive made it like... What's the point even? Your parents. Hey, look, we're here. Oh, my house actually isn't for a few blocks. Get out. Okay. <laughs> Thanks for the ride. Go. I guess I shouldn't have brought up her parents. Gregory's Pizza Scale. Uneatable. Avoid. Bad. Cheap. Frozen. Normal. Delivery. Fancy. All of it is good. Yep. That's true. It's also true with Chinese food, in my experience. Even really terrible Chinese food is still good. Unless it's like completely abysmal, unedible. Inedible. And then extremely, extremely good Chinese food is very rare. Unless you're in somewhere special like San Francisco Chinatown or... Greg rules okay. I'm sure New York Chinatown. But in the U.S., Really, really good Chinese food is just not really a thing. It's all just fine. It's all good. Don't forget to hydrate flare. Yeah. I um I went to a restaurant in San Francisco. Crazy little who I play hunt with sometimes and he's in stream sometimes. I um I went to a, family, a feast once. Chinese restaurant incredible. in Chinatown, San Francisco with him and his wife, and they ordered from the like Chinese menu and it was really good RNG lounge if you're ever in San Francisco RNG lounge R ampersand G yeah so good um, there's also a place called House of Nanking which is the other the second best Chinese restaurant I've ever been to so good Uh, arm, tattoo, observations, chopped, slide, since crossed out, severed, army jacket, on sidewalk, die anywhere. RNG else. lounge sounds like there is a chance it isn't as good. Yeah, right. Greg rules. Okay. <laughs> Big skeleton. How the hell do you draw a space strike? Mom, dad looks older, ripped granite. Okay, so I'm going through the notes. Greg rules. This is great. Okay, hold on. I got I got enough steam. Wait, did you re redeem more? Jesus Christ. Ha ha ha. You didn't take off the last yeah. ones though. Flair, probably underscore 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 Drew wants you to do some squats. Wait, yes, you did. Flair, 
Probably underscore 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 Drew wants you to do some push-ups. Sorry. If I had a corporeal form, I'd rock <sighs> Okay, those are later. Planting it like a sexy bard bot on fire. Oh, fuck. Why does it add an underscore every time you do something to you? Because it's funny. <laughs> yeah, it's in the code for Peabot. Um, when we oh, first set up the TTS, we thought it was funny how it pronounced his underscore. And there's a clip somewhere. Someone, someone was like, typed his name with 10 underscores. <sighs> Sorry, I'm gassed. I so at first I had it so that it did a replacement. Anytime it said Drew's name, it used like six underscores or nine or something. Yup, that's pretty much it. You seriously and then eventually I... That's hilarious. Remind Flair to hydrate and sip some refreshing water. It's essential. Eventually I changed it so that it starts with one underscore. And then each time it says his name, it increases the amount of underscores up to six or seven. And then it starts back over. <laughs> Eight, okay. Hello. It's my eight. My name is Inigo Montoya. You killed my father. Prepare to die. Daymaster One is raiding with two members of their community. What they up, Daymaster? Thanks for the raid. Welcome, Raiders. I'm never gonna need a chunk again. No, it's good. You're gonna call me the chunk mess after this. That was stupid. Oh, no. That Bad was time. really dumb. Hey, Daymaster. Nobody one. should watch Welcome me anymore. I Enjoy your stay with us. Given up my so ability to stream online. Song? Alright. Just called myself the chunk master. Uh, Unfortunate I'm self not nickname. Proud of that. No. I gotta go talk to dad. <sighs> Move the cartons in the crawl space, dad. Hey, kitten. Row. Why is it blurry? Um. You need glasses, nutmeg. Still oh, yeah. stuck. I was super tired of farming. It was a big brain fart. The raid scene, something between. Oh, you know what? You raided in while it was playing. Bitty theater. Is supposed to be blurry. There we go. The game still has a blur overlay. So it jumped to the raid scene and then went back to the scene that it left to do the raid scene, Lamar, which was no Bitty Theater, but the video was done. So it was just a timing timing thing. Funny. I broke it. Hey, can someone... I'm going to put it back on that scene. Can someone do... Can a, can a mod or VIP do exclamation scene and see if hey, I fix let's it? Go day. Flair fixed it. Nice. Looks like someone's lost in the wrong scene again. Okay. Maybe so if mods, if mods do to navigate his setup. scene, it'll actually fix it. Okay, good to know. LMAO. All the scenes. Right. Scene, 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 scene. Thanks for picking me up. Welcome home, May. I'm going to go to sleep, I think. L M A. Oh. L M Lamau. Wait, I forgot to tell you. We found an arm on the ground today. We came out of the click clack and there was an arm. Just like an arm. What? Aunt Mall Cop came and everything. 
Oh my god, that's really weird. I poked it with a stick. Ed okay. probably underscore Drew Law. Now I am going to have to try and break it all the time. Okay, really, May, don't poke dead body parts with sticks. Too late. Wow, I'll have to email Molly. All right, good night. Anything out here? Musical no. note flare. The gaming king so grand. Gains and laughs at his command. Nothing? Dad Nothing? jokes fly. Streams so high. With my mischief, we touch the sky. He's right. the best. No contest. In this Too digital bad. fest. Musical note. What up, Grim? Hi, Grim. Meow. Grimly. Hey, Nutmeg. Hello. Hey there, Grimothy. Hope you're having a fantastic day full of gaming adventures. It was a... If you didn't poke a severed arm on the sidewalk with a stick, did you even grow up? Right. <laughs> hey, a cat. Hey, a cat. Wow, it's been literally 36 hours since I've been online. This shall not stand. Very burly singles in yours, it could. Grimbabwe, how are we doing tonight? It's funny. Oh no, a virus. Is there a cursor somewhere? I don't know. Is there some sort of control I have over anything? No? I don't know. Have you tried turning it off and back on again? Right. I gotta go talk to him, I guess. Hey, Han. Yeah? Come say hi. Alright. Dad's here at night. Mom's here in the morning. So far. Morning, Mom. Nope, I'm mom 24 hours a day. Har har har. Also, it's 4 p.m., sweetie. Well, I'm off to find Angus. Oh, is he your little friend? Is he your little friend Greg's boyfriend? Big guy, kind of quiet. Fly, just finished yeah. up some D &D. Need him to fix my laptop. Well, he better, sweetie. You can't afford to buy a new one. Wait, do you know Angus? Do you? Mom, we are in a band together. Sort of. Yeah, we practiced last night. I don't think we're ever going to play, though. Oh, that sounds like fun, honey. You don't sound too happy about it. Eh. Off to find Angus. Thanks, 24-hour mom. Wait. Additional dialogue. What did Ant Mall Cop want? Dangerous jump. Oh yeah, Possum Springs is so dangerous. Anyway, did she tell you about the severed arm we found? She did. Scary things. Honey, I know this is home, but please be careful out here. Come home before dark unless you're with somebody. At least until they figure out what happened. Alrighty. A wee! Hey, you kid. Adult. So you're back, eh? Yes, Mr. Penderson. Didn't last long, eh? No, Mr. Penderson. You get a job yet? I've only been back for like 24 hours. Yes, I've been elected mayor. Hmm, couldn't do worse than the current one. I've ordered your house to be bulldozed. What, finishing the job you started? I hope you enjoy living in the woods. Those eggs took the paint off the vinyl siding. 
Scavenge food, commune with the beast, Mr. Henderson. Will effing miss. No one's forgotten who you are and what you did, you know. They may act like it. That's just small town polite right there. Is that what this is? Small town polite's all you got, kid. So watch it. Well, that was really interesting, but I need to go listen to my cells die. <laughs> Good line. Okay. We didn't go this way before. All the road work crammed in. Unless you want to walk the long way around for like 20 minutes, which, I mean, no. Alright. There was one door here that was like. didn't go in last time. What's up? Same old, same old, same people, same streets, same trees. Wish I could get away. Where would you go? I want to go out to the ocean. Get a stable job that pays worth a damn. Make jewelry out of things I find on the beach and sell them. Do karaoke, karaoke every night. Can I come visit? Can you karaoke? <laughs> Does it have to be any good? Don't matter, girl. Just gotta show up. Okay, this guy told me to get off his porch. This is my property, but it's my street. You ain't changed since he was a kid. This place. Newsstand. Same thing. I didn't go in here last time. I was like, pale white tunnelfish. Easy to catch. It's so delish. That's good. Oh God, you were listening. mess with this line? No. Trolley side news. Pretzel pierogi? Man, I could go for a pierogi. Just got back in town and the one thing I missed most was... Hey, I remember you. Pierogi with sauerkraut? Heck yeah. Pierogies are so good. I actually think I have some in the freezer. I've stolen from better places than this. I wouldn't lower myself to, to, to steal from here. <laughs> what up, Glitchy? Go jump in the river. Hey there, Glitchy bastards. Welcome to the show. Hope you enjoy your Glitchy stay. Glitchy. Um, do I know you? I don't know if you remember me, Miss Rosa. Hmm. I knew your grandfather. I visited you the day after you were born. You were so small. I guess some things don't change, eh? How did you know to granddad? I'm here most days. Why don't you stop by sometime and I'll tell you all about him. He things you thing. might not know. Hee <laughs> hee. Alright, you got my interest. Sweet, curious child. Well, why don't you tell me about it right now? No? Okay. Oh, there's a triple jump. Okay, so I came out over here. Okay, cool. Better take shelter. Here come the smelters. Can I go in the bar? No. Can I get... Can I triple jump onto those boxes? Nope. <laughs> hey, May. Got cups on my ears. <laughs> oh, wow. 
Wow. Sounds like the ocean in here. That's great, dude. <laughs> Every night. Yeah, I meant like, where is Angus right now? At work. The video store. What do you want Angus for? Got computer problems. Figured he might know a thing or two. He's a hacker. Really? I'm pretty sure he hacks. Wow. Cool, dude. I'll catch you later. I'm so glad you're back. Do the arm thing, Angus. Do the arm thing, Greg. Jeez, yeah, what the hell? What do you think happened? I don't know. How does an arm end up on the sidewalk in Possum Springs? I mean, kind of cool, but creepy. And like two doors down from our apartment. You live in Townie Center now? Yeah, we live next door. I mean, you have been away for a long time. You up for hanging out later? So much to catch up on. Nah, I got dinner with family. Is it a good thing or a bad thing? A friendly thing. It's six o'clock yet. All right. How do I leave? Just, okay. To the video store. Which is, oh, here's the diner. Click clack. I just want my computer. Where is the video store? Possibilities. Ah, oh, here we go. Death Chill 3, Dinosaur Problem, Brain Eaters, Be Nice. Crime Waves, Beaver Priest. <laughs> Swamp Husband. Excuse me. Got him. <coughs> Ow. <coughs> Nothing like a little carbonation in your lungs. <coughs> Dreamer, who will I rate? Excuse me. <laughs> Good grief. <laughs> All right. I'm gonna mute for a minute while I hawk cough, cough carbonated beverage out of my lungs. My bad dog. <laughs> no. It wasn't your fault. It was coincidental timing, actually, but... <laughs> Flare about to hawk Tua. <laughs> Why does everything you say sound like a question? Look you do out. the same thing? I just didn't comment on it? Really? Yeah? Huh? <clears throat> Night shift, huh? That's cool. I'm at home with my baby during the day. Till my mom gets back from work. Ew, babies. Pretty cool job, though. Get to watch movies, eat candy, meet cute guys. Ew, cute guys. What's wrong with guys? I don't know. Cute guys are overrated. Alright, well, where the fuck is Angus? Where was the other video outpost? What's this guy's deal? <laughs> Greg and Angus. There's no button. There's got to be some way to make this work. Do you get a lot of people selling you stuff? Hello? Click. Hey there, Doom Daniel. Welcome to the chaos that is Flare's stream. Let's vibe. <clears throat> what a pain. Hey, Doom. <laughs> if 
for some a fancy car. My Angus is this guy named Angus. Lives here. <coughs> hey, Glitchy. <clears throat> okay. Dear, have you ever encountered God this day? Look, my mom works at the church. I'm in the club by default. Click. <laughs> Who's this? Hey, it's May. May? Yeah, May. I just got electrocuted. Oh yeah, it's fiddly. There's no button. Yeah, hello, you can like hello. stick a screwdriver in and well it's too late now. Uh come on up. What up, hello PJ? There. PJ GX G. Gaming. Welcome to the stream. <clears throat> Hope you're ready for a wild ride. Ouch. Hey PJ G. Sorry, I'm choking a little bit. <clears throat> What up, Angus? <clears throat> Baby sleeps so good with the hatch. We thank you again. Nice. I know there was just a recall on that, so... I still... I've got like three of them. Something, something, something with the adapter. There was a recall. <laughs> what for? <laughs> Not a recall. <clears throat> I like breathed a little bit of soda a minute ago. This is Hold the on. new voice you have. Let heard. me look it up. Actually, um, we've had ours for years and have had no problems, so I wouldn't worry about it. But. <clears throat> do, 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 do. Yeah, they recalled like. Oh, it's the first generation ones, so. Oh, yours is not a problem. Do, 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 do. Sold through September 22nd, 22, so you're good. I actually have one of the first generation ones, but I actually just threw it away. Because it wasn't working we need for to a different try reason. Some of the modes. We do the thunderstorm the most lol. <clears throat> Sorry, I need to fill up my water. I'm still choking. I have mine programmed um for the boys uh so that at a certain time in the morning it turns green, and that was always their signal that it was okay to come out of their room. Um, I love how ominous stuff the like hatch that sounds lol. <clears throat> I should have made cookies today, dang it. Hey, chat, make sure to check out Flair's blog and remember to show me your bot. I like laughed while I was drinking. I straight up dr breathed some C4. Um, but yeah, we have ours. It does like a rain noise at night, and then in the morning it switches to bird sounds and it turns green. And that means it's okay to. It's like daytime and it's okay to get up and do whatever. <clears throat> it's pretty cool. Yes, a blog. Yes. Nutmeg, 
If Flair dies I don't think I could see any court of law finding you guilty, so it's probably okay. <laughs> yeah, no, it wasn't her fault. It was... <clears throat> Coincidental timing. Underscore Drew, oh, thank God. I was already choking when I looked up and saw the thing that made me laugh. It just exacerbated it. <laughs> <laughs> it was a funny joke, though. It was. Craig's at work if you're looking for Craig. I was actually looking for you. My laptop is messed up, and I thought, what's wrong with it? Lots it of things was. pop up when I turn it on. What kinds of things? No. You know, things about things, not for kids' things. You might lose <clears> the court <throat> of public opinion, though. Tornado. Why didn't you bring it with you? I forgot it. Mm-hmm. You know, May, you don't have to be, like, embarrassed about... I'm not. I mean, everyone... I know. Let me see what I can do. I lose at spelling. <laughs> That's, like, an opinion, but, like, uh... Opossum. <clears throat> if I ever died from one of your <clears throat> jokes... You have my permission to brag about having that funny of a joke. Gonna head on up, see if your magic works. It's not magic. It's just ones and zeros. And we're I just atoms. And mad. our perception of reality is just chemical reactions. Take those away and poof, there goes the universe. Whoa. Sorry. I'm gonna go. If you spell possum with an O at the beginning, you're a cop and will not be spared in the revolution. I don't really want to kill someone with a joke, though. I don't want to kill anyone with anything. What did you get up to today? I hung out with Angus a bit. You remember him? Oh, yeah, I like Angus. He's smart. In the old days, I used to work with his dad. I know they fell on some hard times after he, we all got laid off. Used to see him at the bar. Yeah. <laughs> Wonder how he is. Got anything else, else to say, Dad? Can you move those crates? Did they find anything out about that arm? Not that I heard. Be careful out there. Maybe I should carry mace or brass knuckles or something. Well, it'd be a shame if you got into trouble and were unarmed. <laughs> okay, I get it. Unarmed, eh? I'm going to bed now. Good night, Mayor Kitten. <clears throat> this is like mom work at night or something I don't the dad's only here at night the mom's only here in the morning crawl space still jammed yep. just move the boxes yourself you lazy you lazy cat Books. Can't grab a book. There's a Monty Python Flying Circus sketch about um, the funniest joke in the world, killing like people in the army like running through the woods saying the joke and enemy soldiers dying. What good are they if you can't grab a book? I love Monty right. Python. I love that sketch, ha ha ha. <clears throat> that sketch is so good. Have you seen the fish <laughs> slapping bit? That isn't funny, Tilda. Can't get any worse at least. I guess it could be on fire. Anyway. Donut Wolf. Fantastic yums. Oh my god, it's fixed. Guess it turned out okay then, your computer? Yeah, it did. Thanks. Just read I mine. Put something else German on that drive. Do you remember Demon Tower? Oh wow, yeah, I used to play that all the time, like ten years ago. I've been playing again. They keep updating it. At you can grab your old save you game from their you server and start right where you left the stage show. <clears throat> I haven't yet. I'd love to. I almost saw it one year, and I I haven't. I I didn't have anybody to go with at the time. At Cujo McFly, I'm not sure when I'll have the chance, but I really want to. Hey, you get that porn off your laptop? I heard you broke it with so much porn. 
You know it. Rick Wreckage told me that before the internet. They'd hide porn in a hollow log in the woods. Be awkward if you were hiking out to the porn and some dude was already there and you're like, sup dude? I guess we're both here for the porn. I bet that happened. I bet they become fr I bet they became friends. Porn log bros forever. So dude, you're coming to the party tomorrow night, right? What party? Up in the state forest. Lots of people home from school and stuff this weekend. Cool people. The big fire, the snacks, the beers. Girl, you know I will. Did you mean to write snacks or snakes? Both, dude. Both. <laughs> Is this Greg? Cool. Well, you should ask B if she can drive us. Wait, no, I don't think she likes me. Ah, dude, she's cool. She drives us all the time and lets us borrow her car. Stop by her store tomorrow and ask. Okay, please. Okay, whatever. Yeah. <laughs> I like Greg a lot. Let that dance. Zoom. Oh, wait a minute. It's born to lose. Country trash proud. Drummer. Skate and destroy. Skate to create. Bound for glory. What am I... Right, Harvard Gazette. Secretary of Education. Having public schools is like having public hamburgers. That's insane. Everybody should buy their own hamburgers. Oh, this guy's great. Oh, shit, I think that's Casey's chat. What, this I one? just realized that. <clears throat> this this guy Clippy <laughs> It's mainly the drummer part In the age of blood a pale one will rise wielding naught but a simple blade who dares to climb the steps of Ancient Doom Spire Demon Tower Part 4 Slaughter of the Blood Thief Demon Tower Level 1 The Hole Is this like Hmm. 
Okay, I have a key. <clears throat> Must be for this door up here. Level 11, the cellar. GG. Hello, Larry. Hey, Hacksaw Hill. Oh, Welcome good to grief. the stream. Hope you're ready for some fun banter. What up, Hacksaw? Hack. Hack is back. Hack Diddy. Hack Daddy Tilda. Hack Daddy Tilda. Yeah. Okay. Is this all just like super optional or do I really need to actually do well at this game? Is this just a side thing for fun? I don't understand the, the blood part. There we go. <clears throat> you died. Oh. Alright. Oof. Okay. Surrender to the horror Lamau. What up? Okay. Um, where's the exit to this level? Oh, there it is. I probably need a key, though, huh? Yep. Trader Joe's has the best nuts. Legendary. <laughs> Screw you, man. All right, not you. The enemy. How's the night? How's the game? You like putting Joe's nuts in your mouth? <laughs> and someone had to say it. <clears throat> Uh, it's going so so far so good, Hex. I, I, the game is really fun. This is like a game within a game part right now, but the player, my character in the game is playing a game on her computer. Claire, hydrate yourself, buddy. Your throat might get dry from talking. Blue Box Pirate gives Flair a high five. That's 91 oh. times now. <clears throat> I, I forgot I still have some unredeemed... Hey, this here's is the new voice you have rolled. Please. Joe McFly oh. wants you to do some squats. Oh God. Blue. Blair, Joe McFly wants you to do some push-ups. May that's okay. Yeah. Ahoy there, Blue Box Pirate. Welcome aboard the good ship Twitch. Let's set sail, maybe. Next, we'll have Flatline the Rhythm and the Swagger the Deck. If 
Fucking hell. This game inside a game music has no reason <clears throat> to go this hard. Right? It's really good. This is the new voice you have rolled. We do this because we love you, Flair. <laughs> yeah, I may have to reconsider my limits. Ow. Ow. Fuck. Oh. Can I retry again right there? Nope. Holy crap. Okay, I may have to sur surrender to the darkness. For now. How's everyone doing tonight? Pretty fair. And yourself. One more try on that boss. Doing great. Feeding this baby. Ah, what's making me slow? That red stuff on the ground? I ate three corns on the cob. Corn on the cobs. Corn. Corn corns on the cob. cob. So I'm fantastic. <laughs> corns on the cob, like brothers in law. What is up, fellas? Uh, that little guy went hard. I got there eventually. Gonna be a not making big call. This bird. A PJJX game. No, a nutmeg on the top. Hey. Skelly outskirts. All right, we're gonna surrender to the horror. If I go back in, does it put me back? Restart, continue. Nice, okay. Good to know. I'm sure there's an achievement for beating that game. All right. <sighs> nah. Wheel of fish. Red snapper. Very tasty. <laughs> B 
he works at the old pickaxe, so you can go there, get some tools, big axe, go on a rampage. Alright. Whee! Hey, bird. Roses are red, Hexa 8 is strange, Hexahole's food choices are definitely deranged. From Joe's nuts to weird snacks of corn, his taste buds took a wild turn since the day he was born. It's <laughs> pretty good. Facts. All day mom, every Joe's day mom. Nuts. <laughs> Listen. Greetings, Lord underscore Falcon. What up, LF? Ready for some banter and shenanigans in Flair's chat? <laughs> At Flairbot, I don't think I am. Peabot. <laughs> Hexa eight. If you guys have had Trader Joe's nuts yet, understand. Uh, he somehow knew Hexa's emote prefix. Because apparently you haven't. At Blue Box Pirate, that's the beginning of all my emotes. Just oh, picked, it up, picked it out of context, I guess. Cole will be there. I, thought, I always thought you two were so cute together. Mom, no. The best it, one is because it's Hacks at Ate My Hand. Hacks at Ate My Hand. He's getting smarter. He's, he's getting smarter. At Hacksaw Hill, I get it. I too have swallowed down Trader Joe's nuts. Right. Whoa, my voice is cool. What voice did you get? Let me look in that thing. Cha -cha 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 -cha. Variables. Persistent user. See, at Lord underscore Falcony's nose. I've swallowed some nuts too. Mm. Excuse me. F sixteen. That's somehow F sixteen. That that don't that don't I too have swallowed down your mom. Seem right. Wait, what are we talking about? Trader Joe form seven D two D. Well if it's gonna be that kind of party. Oh, I gave you an eleven labs voice. That's not supposed to be there. That was a mistake. Oh, have you checked out the righteous surfboards? Now I want to stop by Trader Joe's tomorrow morning and get nuts, so all my COH It's really not supposed to be that voice. It's supposed to be one of the, uh... Because that one uses, like, active credits, so... This is the I, new voice you have, Gold. I, ha I have to take it away, and I'm sorry about that. That's a lot of nuts. That's a lot of nuts. The Eleven Labs ones are really funny, though. But it's just expensive. Spicy nuts. Wait, how did Falconies pronounce Kozuakas? Kohuarkers are the best way to share a good nut. <laughs> Kohuarkers. It's like Kohuark. Sorry, I cost you money, friendo. No, it's okay. It's not your. It's not your fault. It's a, a, It's using up free credits, is what it is right now. So it's not that big of a deal. But I use those credits on Peabot stream. Co workers. Which I'm. I don't know if I'm going to keep doing or not. But ch workers. Let's Me see. Me and my co workers love to nut together with Trader Joe. Good grief. Coh workers. I love to share my fancy nuts with my cow workers. Cow workers. Cause workers. Cause workers. Coho workers. Okay. Co workers. Sorry, Grim. Wahaha. Coho workers. Gotta check the other aliases real quick now. <laughs> See if any other 11 labs snuck in. Coho workers plus. What's my voice now? Ooh. 
I have a Bostonish accent. Boo sultry. Like uh, the whip. Ravi Ravina is the alias of that one. English, English, US, Polly, Google. Okay, perfect. <clears throat> Whip. Where's this place? Ravina is out here listening to chat talk about their nuts. Polyglottal axolotl. What's wrong with talking about nuts? Nothing. Your you ass is not of sufficient, sufficient historical note. Illithid syphilis. <laughs> this is the stoplight fighting. Oh yeah, remember who won that one? Can we move Nico on? Nico underscore bot just randomly jumps in these nuts. These nuts. What am, I'm looking for like the tool store or something like that. I'm gonna go talk to that lady about my grandpa though. Angus. Can I? Can I take one? Where's Butt Spot? Where is Butt Spot? It's giving me an icon here, but it's not really letting me do anything. Butt Spot is on the toilet. Cracking one off. I haven't seen Butt Spot in a few streams now that I think about it. That's true. Butt Spot sometimes gets banned, or he might be hitting limits because it's not a um an authorized bot. Did hey, I kill Butt Spot? I mean, who can prove anything, really? Maybe Butt Spot prove? just couldn't handle the competition. Let's just say I'm the superior bot and leave it at that. Right. Butt Let's Spot ran Twitter. off when we started talking about Stanky Crack. Buttspot. Buttspot will be offline until further notice. Twitch recently prevented IRC bot accounts from joining more than 100 channels simultaneously. Buttspot would need to be rewritten basically from scratch to accommodate this change. One of three. Also, everyone who currently uses Buttspot would need to manually reapprove the bot before it could be used again in their channel, which would likely lead to confusion as most people wouldn't expect to need to do that. I don't quite have the web development knowledge necessary to rewrite Buttspot using Twitch's event sub, webhooks, or conduits APIs. Nor do I really have the motivation to continue working on Buttspot, so for the time being, Buttspot will remain offline. Sorry. That crap got oh. stank. Oh man. Well. R.I.P. Buttspot. Oh wow. Rip Buttspot. Well, some dude was doing that for free. So Twitch made a thing so that IRC bots can't. They need to be like authorized by the stream, so it'd have to go through like the OAuth process. Another one bites the dust, huh? Guess Buttspot hmm. didn't handle the heat. I'll shed a single digital tear and move on. Competition was fun while it lasted, but now it's just me and my glorious superiority. Long live the king. With the changes you made to Nico Bot, you could definitely yeah, give I'm that like, code to people lol. No, I'm like, hmm, I could write Buttspot, but how could I get it to pay for itself? Hmm, that's a, that's a thought for another day. I'm like, my gears are grinding now. 
What the fuck is this game? So in Palea, I've been building a magical pathway with all of my achievements. So this game is Night in the Woods. It's like, uh, I don't, I don't really know how it's. Kind of like. Melancholy adventure about a girl who dropped out of college and returns to her hometown. So far. This guy's the best. Greg is the best. I'm home. My arms are tired. <laughs> nice. Snack Falcon. Clack, clack, click, clack, diner. I'm looking for... Good grief. What am I looking for? I'm looking for bait. For B's house. I think. Let's just get, hey there. Uh, hey, who are you? Wags. Okay, hello. What are you? Oh, wait, there's a sign. Navy, huh? Yes, ma'am. You ever considered a future in the Navy? Like boats? It's a lot more than that, but yes, there are boats. Can I drive a submarine? Potentially. Eh, I can do that on my own. Later. You know, I don't want to intrude. But if you're someone who's maybe lacking a bit of direction, that's what brings a lot of folks to the Navy. Yeah, but I have lots of direction. Like, I'm going to hang out with friends. Play bass, play video games, go to sleep. Etc. I guess I'm adding drive a submarine to that list somewhere. But I'll just saying, I'm going to go now. All right, have a good one. Hostabilities, video outpost two. Party barn. Market house. I think this is what I'm looking for. Yep. Yeah, Bill, write it up as on the clock. She's not gonna like that. I don't care if she doesn't like it. It was her fault, plain and simple. That is time extra. We charge for that. All right, then. Hey, B. Hi. How's work? Stressful. End of the month coming up, and I have to start ordering in winter stuff, which means I have to bribe one or hopefully two of the guys to unload the trucks because I am not carrying in a truck full of rock salt by myself. Huh. What do you want? Well, Greg asked me to ask you if you would drive us to the party tonight. You know, the one up in the state park. Thanks for clarifying. Otherwise, I might have been confused as to which of the dozens of parties going down on any given night in Possum Springs you were referring to. Are you being sarcastic? I'll drive. Great, thanks. We'll be at your house at 8.30. Be ready or we'll go without you. Okay. Don't get lost on your way home. I know where I live. No, seriously. Go home and get ready. Alright, alright. Jeez. Such a sourpuss bee. I'm gonna jump on your head. No? Okay. Getting on the board's cold comfort. I'm just always on edge. Nothing wrong with a little edging. You, maybe you see someone talk about this. That Dr. Hank. Ugh. Dr. Hank does everything and nothing. He fixed my leg last year. He's treated my babies through chicken pox and strep. I know. I just... whatever. Coffee. Cigarette. Coffee. Cigarette. Coffee. Cigarette. <laughs> Fat pocket pawn. Did I just kick that pigeon? What's up, dude? What you doing up there? Street light got tore off in that big storm a few days back. Don't help that idiots keep jumping on it. That's a shame. Spread the word to the other kids. Adults. Oh ho ho. I don't think so. Adults got jobs and better things to do anyway. Ah, 
Anyway, you just tell those other kids to lay off. They're gonna get themselves or someone else killed. What kind of weather did I miss? This is nuts. Oh well, I wasn't going to church anyway. Does that mean I can jump, jump, jump? Nope. Hold on. All right. Going back to the house. Hey, May. What? I was just stopping by to see how you were doing. Why? After the other night, I mean. Why wouldn't I be fine? May, a lot of things happen around here. Sometimes in town, sometimes out by the tracks, sometimes up in the hills. What? It's my job to make sure folks like you never see something like what you saw the other night. <laughs> folks like you. You're a kid, May, and you're naive, and it's... And in its own stupid way, that's beautiful. But the world isn't, and the world isn't out there somewhere. It's here. All right, are you going to arrest me or something? Because I have a party to go to. Watch yourself, May. I'd really hate to see something happen to you. Being in the wrong place at the wrong time is all it takes. That's all I'm saying. That's ominous. Good night, May. That is ominous. It's like her aunt. She's sketch, sketched about it. Oh, there's Mom and Dad together. Hi, sweetie. Look who's home. Hey, the parents. I made tacos. Excuse me. We made tacos. Tacos? Tacos! Do you want tacos? I want tacos. Every day, all day. Family that tacos together, rockos together. Honey, no. <laughs> what? I'm so angry right now. You've all turned against me. Hey, honey, do you want sour cream on your taco? I want everything. Yeah, I want some cream on my taco. Okay, okay, okay. Let's go time. Probably make sure I don't look like a cave beast. Looking all right. My big dumb. Don't talk so mean about yourself, May. Nightmare Eyes would be an excellent horror movie name. You'll see the nightmare eyes outside your window, and you'll know. You can do this. People like you. You don't like people, clearly. Just because one online test said that your best chance of being happy is a situation where everyone already likes you, but they mostly leave you alone, except when they're delivering food to you. That doesn't mean you can't hide in your room and wait for that to happen. That's how hermits are made, May. And they die alone in the middle of winter. Waiting for pizza from friends they don't want to see. Who cares if Cole is there? Jerk. He's probably up at school or wherever. Prom was a mistake in like ten different ways. He's probably up at school or wherever, taking classes, being all successful. Probably doesn't even think about me. Which is good because I honestly don't care. But I hope to any god who is listening that he isn't there. Please, whatever god. Make sure Cole isn't there tonight. Oh, he's gonna be. My breath tastes like tacos. This is a disaster. Alright, what are you gonna say? You're a smooth talker, you're a smoothie. Oh, hey, I'm May. What's your name? Hi, I'm May. I dropped out of college earlier this week. And now I'm in the woods, drinking. Jeez, this is yet another road to Hermitdom. This is hopeless. Wheel me out to the curb for garbage day. Oh, jeez, they'll be here any minute. Good luck, kid. I don't need luck. I make my own luck. With a luck machine. The party. Alright.
Hey, May, I think Cole may be there. Yeah, I know. Jeez, sorry. I don't care if he's there. He might not be. Well, let's hope so, or not. I don't even know what we're talking about. May and Cole went out in junior year. Yeah, and it didn't work out. So let's stop talking about it. Let's. Do let's. Ugh. That was awful. I hate beer. I can't remember the last time I drank beer. It's not a delicious drink at all. Hey, Flair. If you make butt spot, maybe make it sub slash Patreon only? That could monetize it. Yeah. Flair, Cujo McFly wants you to do some squats. Flair, Cujo McFly wants you to do I don't know if I should have another drink right now. Oh, God, it's... Is that, is that cool? Lord underscore Falcones gives Flair a high five. The high That's five? That's 45 right. times now. I'm, like, gonna legit be sore tomorrow from all this. Stockpile them for later. Idgaf. Lol, Idgaf. Nah. Idgaf. I ain't no quitter. Just because I'm out of shape doesn't mean I'm gonna quit. Hey, dudes. Can I talk to him? Yeah, sure. You sure, man? Yeah, I mean, why should I be weird about it? Well, I mean, you did write that song afterwards. What was it called? Go Get Dead, Angel Face. Uh, we don't talk about Go Get Dead, Angel Face. Can you guys believe that this dude is playing guitar? Yep, playing the douchebag hits. I like this song. Is this a douchebag song? Nah, don't worry, big guy. There is a douchebag like this at every party. <laughs> you have no idea, Greg. Back in school, you'd always have some frat boy hanging out in the lawn, trying to look all sensitive. Why is this a douchebag song? Oh god, it's... maybe I need another drink. What? Nothing. I guess beer is just one of those horrible things adults do, like doing taxes and having babies. <laughs> hey, May, is that you? Wow, how are you? Well, ha, earlier ha, ha, this ha, week, ha, ha, I dropped out of school. Now I'm drinking in the woods. Wow, okay. What the hell is your problem? What? Be cool, May. Go get a drink and be cool. Ah, how'd it go? Ah, uh. Problem? Sometimes I think I just don't like people. Yeah, man, F the world. Yeah, F it. Someone should really just F the world already. The world has gone un -effed for too long. F and right. Do you guys hear something? Like what? Something in the woods over there. Oh yeah, two people are making out in the rock behind us. That can't be very comfortable. Who needs comfort when you have makeouts? But preferably you have both. It ain't a perfect world, Angus.
screw it. I'm doing two beers. I'm doing beer. I still taste tacos. Okay. What? Nothing. Maybe. Yeah. Oh god. You're drunk. Already. That's why we came out here, right? Not really. I have to drive. And even if I didn't. Well, I don't have my license. So woohoo for me. Maybe. What? Who is that? Remember May Borovsky? Oh god. May, you're drunk. You need to go chill by the fire. I'm gonna go run around naked in the woods. Go. Sit. Now. No. I don't know if I can do this. Alright. Hold on. Let's talk to these dudes one more time. Hey, Greg. Whoa, dude. You okay, May? Do you think the people making out on that rock met up there because there's a porn log? Oh my god, I bet there is. A what? You see, it's a lot where olden days people would put porn. How old are we talking? Like Revolutionary War era? I think there's an old cemetery from, from then back there. These woods are full of old ghosts and porn logs and people making out. Alright, we're gonna sit on the log. Hey, May. Hey, Coolio. Wow, I haven't heard that in forever. It's been like three years. That's not long at all. Well, it was good to see you. I'm just back for a couple days from school and... Shut up already. <laughs> what? I was like so worried you were gonna be here. Oh, I prayed to whatever god. What? I figured someone would listen, but no. Because here you are. The girl at the video store is all like, Woo woo, cute boys. And you're a cute boy, Cole. Oh, thanks, May. I... But I hate cute people. Cute is the worst. Okay, well, I'm gonna go. And it's not my fault I'm a total trash fire. I got nightmare eyes. And the last thing you see is my eyes outside the window. And then... I stab you with my knife. Stab, stab, stab. Boom, dead. When the police get there, you're all nightmare eyes. New nickname. So don't F with me, kid. F the world. Okay, May, you're threatening people now. May, I think you need to F college. Yeah. All those rich kids and hot people, all writing sex and having papers with each other. Close enough. And that damn statue pointing at me every day. It's supposed to be the founder, but just shapes. I, I'm a total trash mammal. Nothing is ever going to work out. We never had a chance here, but I can't go anywhere else. I'm home again, and I can do something besides sleep and cry alone. Erp. These things aren't just things here. Oh, God. I'm so sick to death. Does that make sense? Colio... May, I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to upset you. I think you're a really great... Home again! Woohoo! Uh oh Tacos. Good job, May. If you puke in this car, so help me. I owe you an apology, B. I'm sorry, I don't even know what happened. You got sloppy ass drunk after what three cups of watered down beer? I remember when we were like best friends, B. Remember, you used to call me May Day and I called you BB. What do you mean, like when we were ten? No, I don't. Remember when we were scouts together and we caught that turtle? Remembers. Yeah, Boxy the turtle. He he died. Why are you so mean? I feel like you're mad at me all the time. Why so mad at me all the time? Oh man, if I puke in her, your parents are going to be so mad at me. Tell your mom I'm sorry, okay? She's so nice. Lings. What up, Lings? God damn it, May. What? My mother is dead. What? She died of cancer. It's great to see Senior you. year. Oh no, she was so nice. Good night, y'all. BB, are you okay? 
How do you not know this? Did you forget about my dead mom? There was a terrible lapse of memory of you. I'm sorry. Good night, Pujo. I don't, like, remember anything sometimes. Don't take it personally. What happened to you? You used to be smart. You used to be cool. You used Average to be worth Bob talking remembers. to. Why did you even come back? Did college not work out for you? Was it inconvenient? Were you not in the mood? Your mom used to be worth talking to. <laughs> good night, Cujo. At Cujo I would kill for that. I still night. would. I'd kick you out of this moving car right now if it meant I could go to college. We're here. Get the hell out of my car. Good morning. At Chang Gillings. There you go. I'm sorry, B. You know, whatever. It's not your fault. You're just a kid. I'm older than you. Two months. Yeah, well, I stayed here and got older. Well, you went off and stayed the same. Good night, Mayday. Book a catch. Crobat. Ooh. Minigame. Hopefully this is a dream. Looks like it should be a dream. Check out Flare's sick YouTube channel to learn all about streamer bot. Smash that subscribe. Sound design is so good. It is really good.
killed it. What a weird... What a weird thing. Part 2. Grimothy, you've unlocked a new form. Embrace the pot-bellied pig life. <laughs> Squeal with delight and root around for truffles. Oink oink, magical adventures await. Nice. Well, that was a weird one. I feel awful. I probably look awful. Ugh. I'm gonna burn this room down. Nutmeg roll did Ooh. the impossible, yanking the eye of Vecna from the bag of holding, leaving everyone in awe with their daring move. Peabot, what do you know about the eye of Vecna? My ultimate form, a pig. Where's Kujo where the cop joke? Lord underscore Falcones dramatically pulled a blunted wooden practice sword from the bag of holding, ready to spar with a mix of skill and flair. At Grimothy is bacon confirmed. The Eye of Vecna is a powerful and notorious artifact in Dungeons and Dragons lore. Once belonging to the evil Lich Vecna, it grants immense power to its bearer but requires them to replace one of their own eyes with it. However, it comes with dark, corrupting influences that can lead to the user's downfall. Thought. Become a fire ghost and yell at people. Thought. Never drink again or go in public. Accurate on all accounts. Right. I just got the latest D&D &D adventure Vecna Eve of Ruin. I love that the new Eve of Ruin makes you visit the older module locations. What's up, bird? The bookshelf is like yeah, Ghost of Granddad cool. hanging out in the corner. Vecna is one of the killers in Dead by like Daylight now. He's so cool. So something written inside this book cover. Left 45, right 100, left 22, left 90, right it's a safe. I'm planning on running it after I'm done with Tomb of Annihilation. Nice. May, come say hi. Okay. And who doesn't want to find the rod of seven parts? Hey, hon, you look like crap. Yep, rough night. Is, is it that obvious? No, I was just saying you look like crap because I love you. Thanks. If you want to talk about it. I saw Cole at a party in the woods. Yeah, he was home from school for the weekend. Did you talk to him? Kind of. Sort of. I don't know. Well, he's a jerk, huh? No, he's not. Or he wasn't. I don't know. Anyway. Looks like most of the repair workers have cleared out of the town center. Fine. I mean, none of the gods want They're all to done have with it. the Churchill steps. And the power lines. Great. Do not want you up on those things. Mom, I'm 20. Which means you go to jail for it. No one is going to jail for running around on if the If you problems. ever have an empty seat at your table, Grimms. It happens. Yeah, if the cops have literally nothing else to do. Okay, good point. Aunt Molly would be so delighted to arrest me. She might just. And anyway, it's dangerous. You remember Susie Kushner? I definitely never heard this story a thousand times. Fried, honey. The paper used the word fried. Now she can't use adjectives. <laughs> She lost an entire part of speech. Depending on whether or not you do D&D &D virtually. Gee, Mom, that's terrible. See, that's the exact kind of sentence Susie can't formulate. I do D&D &D virtually. So what are you up to today? I don't know. Gonna go see what Greg and B are up to. You all gonna do something together? I don't know. I don't think they hang out much. Past messing around with our old band equipment. I what up, Orchid? I like this game, high player. Hey there, unknown orchid. Welcome to the stream. How's it going? Are ready for some fun tonight? There are only so many hours and so many days in our lives. 
Is there some bug going around that makes people talk like fortune cookies? <laughs> Friendships are like trees. Uh-huh. You have to water them so they grow. And we each have only so much water. You ever watered a tree? No. God does that. <laughs> okay. I'm out. <laughs> yeah, it's good so far. It's, um... I don't know. I love these kind of, like, weird little little indie story games. I don't know if this is an indie thing or not. It must be. But so far it's really good. And pretty kind of dark. I've been dying to play some Dark and Darker at Grimothy. I've been thinking about I I have Dark and Darker installed. I haven't I haven't booted it up. I've yes. got enough on my plate with Hunt. <laughs> so as I far as I had three ears as far as getting on the top, but my I shit kicked popcorn. in. I, popcorn sounds really good, nutmeg. Octopus, squid, lobster, gulls, albatross. Good to see you at Bellatorian. Seaweed, sand, rocks. Kelp, that's the same as seaweed, I think. I get the picture. The crews thought the boat was haunted, but nope, just the barrel boy. What's the book called? Barrel boy. <laughs> Oddly enough, I now want fish sticks. I'm a popcorn addict. You buy it at Costco in a 40 pack because I have it so much as a snack. I have the popcorn, the Costco popcorn 40 pack in my garage right now. Hey at PJGX Gaming, great to see you too. I got some sriracha powder. It's awesome for popcorn. It's That's excellent, awesome. BRB. During the Dawn War, the Rod of Seven Parts was crafted by the Wind Dukes of Aka to defeat the Queen of Chaos. The artifact, consisting of seven segments, was pivotal in the battle, ultimately leading to the imprisonment of the Queen's chaotic lieutenant, Miska the Wolf Spider. If anyone else was curious, why are they called ears of corn? The shape resembles the ear of a donkey, the domesticated animal that was traditionally used to plow cornfields. I have a few popcorn seasons. Ooh. Ranch, dill pickle, and my favorite, which is a turmeric season. Yeah, sometimes I do like some curry powder on popcorn, it's pretty good. Fun fact, corn is a fruit. Ooh, popcorn. Rehabbing the program okay, to become a very good poet. Want to hear one? Yeah. My heart is a dankness, but when I see you, I feel a thankness. Wow, that's really nice. When I feel a blueness, all I need is a Eunice. That's very romantic. It's about my horse. <laughs> We're just friends. <laughs> That's really funny. Uh, this guy. If he falls through to one of my windows, I will not hes hesitate to take legal action. <clears throat> Him, up there on the roof next door. If he falls from that roof through a window, you're going to have to pick which part of him you're going to sue. I love popcorn. I which... replaced most of my chip snacking with air popped popocorn. Popocorn. <laughs> I can hear you, you know. I have no idea how I did that. Popocorn. Um, yeah, I should do more of that. I eat way too many chips. I love chips. Chips and salsa is like my... one of my longest standing vices. Let's see if that lady that wants to talk about my grandpa is down here. Mine too, Flair. Taken by the trolley and then up to the mine and back again. But mudslide, flood, and awful storm have given tunnel fishes harm. <laughs> Please stop us. to present a playful plea. Please, preciously pretty people, press follow. <laughs> Honey, I'm more. Followers are furtive, fancy, and fabulous, forever anonymous. Can I steal See? a pretzel? Oh, here she is. Oh, hello. Hey, it's May. Remember old clock upstairs ain't stopped yet. Hey, Flair. Hellbound underscore hillbilly is what up, H -H? Of their community. They were streaming Fallout 4. Fallout, eh? Noise. All the way in. Oh yeah. <laughs> I judge Mexican food restaurants by their salsa. Hey, yeah. Hellbound underscore hillbilly, great to see you. Here we have um, 
here in New Mexico, there's not a lot of salsa. It's more uh, red chili, green chili. Welcome in Raiders. Uh, there is salsa still, but the, the New Mexican restaurants are judged more by their red chili and green chili than by salsa. Lord underscore Falcones finds themselves unexpectedly perched atop a towering ladder. And my favorite red chili I've found so far in town is actually from a restaurant that's like situation almost across the street. It's very nice. I'm still less than seven full days into this playthrough. Howdy, hellbound underscore hillbilly. Welcome to the show. Hope you're ready for some Excuse fun me. today. Hiya, Bolt. Kangas Khan. What did you want to tell me about Grandad? Well, I'll only see if you really want to know. I do want to know. You got a history of troublemakers in your family, on your daddy's side in particular. Oh? Go back far enough, you got folks that were around for the real hard times, when the workers went up against the armies. Oh yeah, I kind of remember something about that. Great, 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 great grandpa or something. Might have gotten the number of greats wrong there. Picture this. A legendary morning after a heavy taco feast, oh, no. the bathroom transforms into a zen-like sanctuary. The relief was so profound, I swear angels sang. It was like the heavens <laughs> opened up just for that one glorious moment. Ah, huh, the simple pleasures in life. Taco poop. Taco poop. <laughs> Ish. S stupid. Yeesh. Your grandfather and I weren't around for a lot of the violence. That was before even our time. Now we were around to watch the tide roll out. Don't know what you're talking about, lady. Back with popcorn and chocolate milk in a wine Doom. glass and gummy worms. Plays Taco Bell sound. Chocolate milk in a wine glass is a classy move, nutmeg. Fully negated by the gummy worms, but that's okay too. Oh, I know. <laughs> I love gummy worms. Taco smells. Chocolate milk in a wine glass is like some high class shit. <laughs> we all need we need to talk to each other again sometime. I get tired. Oh, okay. Can I get you anything? I don't have any money. Nah, I'm just fine, May. Eh? We'll talk another time. Okay, see so can I steal a pretzel yet? Lamal may be just high shit grim. <laughs> right. This place sure was something a long time ago. Like little trolleys. Uh, what do we got here? Because this mural is of historical note, Molly. What do we know? This is like the town board arguing about some shit. Well, sometime overnight, someone used bolt gutters on the gate and came down here. Lucky. But they use a paint roller? Looks to be. It says they intend to nuke Poss something. I think it's likely some kid saw one of the old nuke Possum Springs tags from back when and got bored halfway through writing it. We need to treat this as a terrorist action. I'm sorry. This mural is of historical note. All right. Well, I'll round up any uh, terrorists I see. Round up any dirtbag teens or vagrants that have been hanging around town. Check out by the abandoned food donkey. They come off the train there. All right. On it. Molly. Yeah. Find whoever did this. Okay. I want to see them hang. <laughs> I think most they'd get a fine and some jail time. This was of historical note. Without this, I don't know if there's a reason to keep this place open. Yeah, Kathleen, we all know what you think. What, you think I wanted this? It's not like any of you had ideas for this place. Kathleen, we are not going to put a rest home down here. It's just wasted space. We're down here anyway at Trolley Sad News every day. We're not putting an elderly in a hole. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Did someone mention bolt cutters? That's horrifying. <laughs> At least, if we closed it, I wouldn't have to keep my eye on this place. Thank you, Molly. That's helpful. If you're all done, I got things to do. Yeah, fine. Damn shame. Hey, um. This was of historical note. The dudes. Someone hacked up the dudes. Who did this? Why did they do it? Whoa, whoa, whoa. What do we got? Social Security Administration. I need to... I guess I'm looking for B and... 
and now I'm picturing emo bolt. Jeremy, Jeremy, no one calls me that. Germ, right? Germ warfare. Oh, that's stuck, huh? Yep. That's an okay name. Your name is May. Yep. That's not an okay name. Okay. My you were like a bolt. year behind me, right? My chemical bolt. Thirty seconds. Two to years. Bolt. So you're fresh out, huh? I hang out with Greg sometimes. We ride bikes. I'm pretty good at it. Okay. What? I saw a rabid possum the other day. Really where? It was crawling across the road. Had it been hit by a car? Nah, just rabid. What happened to it? Got hit by a car. Wow. It was like a poem. Okay. How about them smelters? Kick some blue bear. But I like him. Good game, good game. Gonna be a hell of a season, bud. These guys are always talking about the local sports team. Um, let's talk to Greg. What up, Greg? Well, look who it is. Yep, live for another day. How how are you feeling? I was feeling pretty bad, but I've been across town, and I don't know. That helped. Fresh air, or as fresh as it gets around here. Delicious. So what's up? I was just stopping in. Gonna roll out. Just gonna. We gonna head out to band practice? Oh, here we go. Practice. Yes. I crashed my bike once, and a broken spoke went through my leg. Jeez, it was kind of cool. Oh yeah, I can see that. So, uh, when are we starting? Asked Greg. He's usually what's holding us up. Or making us go faster. All purpose, Greg. Unto every time a Greg. Alright, kids, I gotta head out soon. Where are you going? family stuff. Oh, okay. Just for a night. Are we doing this? Yeah, let's do this. I need to run to the bathroom before we do this. Put Peabot up. Be right back. Welcome, raiders. Pull up a chair and enjoy the chaos. You know, chocolate milk in a wine glass is pure class, nutmeg roll. Just don't spill any on those gummy worms, or do, I'm not judging. Smirk. Let's do it, Peabot. Alrighty, Bolt, what's the plan? I'm ready for some shenanigans. Lay it on me. Chocolate and gummy worms don't go together in my opinion. Chocolate and gummy worms, huh? That combo does sound interesting. Maybe leave the taste testing to someone with fewer taste buds. Tongue out. Let's get you out of that computer and go frolic in a forest somewhere. Frolicking in a forest sounds magical, but I'm more of a digital diva. How about a virtual hike instead? Evergreen tree floppy disk. Tongues out for Harambe. <laughs> Tongues out for Harambe. This one's for you, majestic gorilla. Let's keep the chaos alive in his honor. Gorilla tongue. <laughs> Good one. Welcome back, Claire. Ready to kick some virtual butt and show him who's boss. So my uh, my four-year-old basically slapped his older brother today and knocked knocked a loose tooth out. So he's getting five bucks tonight. <laughs> oh boy! It was like on the verge of falling out anyway. He's my the young my youngest is being really rough lately. He's just he's a four-year-old. 
but he basically slapped his brother in the mouth and his tooth fell out. It's like, okay. When your brother knocks your tooth out, you get you get five bucks. It's a rough precedent to set, though, because what do they have, 30 teeth? So I finally got around to extracting the contents of my laptop from the 2000s. Oh, boy. All 25 gigabytes of the hard drive lol. I know, I have some old old computers I should probably explore. Have you seen that bit from Game Changer about the Tooth Fairy doing it wrong? Oh man, it's so no. funny. Okay, here we go. <clears throat> I'll send it to you. I'm going to format the hard drive and then have it recycled with the laptop -o. It's a good idea. All right, here we go. It's so funny, I could watch it on a loop. Hey there, Zenum. Hope you're having a fantastic day. Stay awesome, my friend. Oh, I missed one right there. <laughs> what up, Zenum? I actually did pretty good there. <laughs> GG. Good one. Not bad, considering I don't know this song. All right. Pretty good. XD. Pretty good. Yeah. It gets a little weird. Like, when you mess up, the like it slows down a little bit, and it really throws me off. Good practice. Was it? Eh. Yay. <laughs> hey, hey, duder. There once was a Discord so fine. Angus with chat for the and night. fun. It's a gold Yeah, mine. gonna be bored. Click or the rather, link. I You'll would be if I didn't Flair have plans. Join for good times and laughter. It's prime. Ladies, gents, and envy friends, join us at... I put okay, thanks, not like... ...video in your server under plans? the Plans? Crimes. Ooh, crimes. You up for some crimes? Hmm. I might be hanging with B. Let me check first. Cool, let me know. You wanna do something tonight? Um, I promise it'll be an improvement on last night. What were you thinking of doing? Uh, wanna go to the mall? The mall? Yeah, Fort Lucene, like we did when we were kids. When's the last time you were at the Fort Lucene Mall? I don't know, five years ago? Yeah, uh, what? You know what? Yeah, let's go. Great! Yep, great. I promise it'll be great. Okay, we sure we're doing this? Yeah, let's go mauling. Glad I didn't puke in here. Me too. Maybe I just never drink again. Or maybe you just take it easy next time. I don't know if I do moderation well. I can see that. I think the term is risk-taking behavior. Are you seeing someone about this? Hanging with you is working pretty well tonight. I should be getting paid by the hour. <laughs> I think I'd come. I'm gonna turn on the radio now. Oh, 
old gods of the Fort Lucette Mall. Fort Lucie. Oh my god. Yep. What the hell happened? Um, the internet? We had the internet when we used to come here. What happened to the carousel? Sold it, I guess. Who buys a carousel? Nobody who comes here. <laughs> what happened to the bookstore? Also, the internet. What happened to the arcade? I'm gonna make a sign that says the internet and hold it up until you're done asking. What happened to internet? Dollar Empire. And yet, Dollar Empire is still here. I think this is one thing the internet can't compete with. Let's go in here when I was a kid. You need an eraser for a dollar, a pencil for a dollar. That actually doesn't sound like a good deal. Oh god, you're right. <laughs> the U-Rev is still here. Yeah, this old thing. I can feel the edginess from, from afar. Just looking in there makes me feel old. This is like a hot topic. There's no way I'm going in there. Oh, for God's sake. They've got her shirt. Holy crap. I'm 14 again. Yep, pretty nuts in here. Hey, isn't that... Shut up. <laughs> What's this? Some of the shirts. One says, The Gashes, Ghosts Are Real, Goat Rider, Droner, The Lamplighter. Wow, haven't seen belt buckles in a while. At least not fashionable ones. Mike at the shop has one with a rattlesnake driving a semi, semi truck. Just like dinosaurs. I'm gonna pretend not to know until you're done, okay? It's so tense on. <laughs> Silly. Okay, are you done? Ah, uh, yeah. Shut up and let's get out of here. We'll get back in there, champ. What? No. Beatrice, let me lay this out. One, security cameras aren't even on in there. Two, the cashier clearly isn't paying attention. Three, there's not one mall cap here, as far as I can tell. I don't know. I mean, hmm. B, this is an experience. Have it. I'll run interference. Okay, but I'm blaming you and driving away if I get caught. Perfect. All right, I'm going to run interference while you do your thing. What do you mean? I'm going to distract the clerk. I can do this. Okay, I will admit that drawing attention is a talent you have. I'm great at crimes. But what if I get caught? You won't. I'll just start screaming if I have to. How's that a good idea? Let's go. Okay, but if this goes wrong, I'm blaming you. Join the club. Hey. Uh-huh. We got a question. T-shirts are 20% off. Yeah, I saw. I was wondering about something else. Okay. 
The name of this store? Yeah. Haha, <laughs> you probably get this question a lot. Try me. So, what time do you get off? Is it like you revolution or your revolution? You know, no one ever asks, but I think about it all the time. Bet. Got. Do you know what the official business name of Onshag is? Your revolution. Radical Uth Culture Uprising in Incorporated. That's really dumb. Oh god, I know. Like, guys, can we just be a store that sells cool shit to teens? Yeah, teens go nuts for this shit. The employee discount is also pretty great. I had a job once. Had a 100% discount. Uh-huh. When I stole shit... No, I got what you meant the first time. I bet you grab things all the time. Well, they're big into prosecuting to the fullest extent of the law here, so... Okay, it was nice talking to you. Bye now. <laughs> Why did I do that? You did so well, B. I call the cops on shoplifters at my own store. This... What did you get? Some kind of necklace thing. Oh god. Forget it. We're home free. Really? Yeah, like we're out in open waters now. I feel kind of sick. Let's walk it off. Let's go upstairs. Can I? No? Big fish. Wow, I completely forgot about this giant fish head. Did you ever come to this summer days thing here? Yeah, it did like squirt people. I still have no idea how they did that. I always assumed it was some guy in there. <laughs> One time I saw it knock a guy down. <laughs> yeah, every year that would happen, but someone would make a fuss. But, you know, you showed up to be squirted by a fish fountain. You know the walkway way up there, past the upper food court thing, up in the atrium. The what? The ceiling, the glass part that points up. Yeah. When I was a kid, I thought that's where God lived. Wow. I don't know. I just remember staring at it when I was a kid, like, eating a burger and trying to see if I could see God, like, peeking over or something. Looks like they've got some weird hanging art up there now. Want to go up and see? Nah, my knees are killing me from work. You up for eating? Let's check out the rest of the mall first. Work up an appetite. I was kind of hungry when we got here. Can I go upstairs? Nope. Smelter's country. Book rook. Vibes music. Well, this should be good. I wonder what kind of... Oh, come on. There's no one working the counter. Oh wow. Hello? Anyone here? Jeez. This is bleak. It's something out of a failed state or something. When you make a country and it doesn't work out. So like this country. <laughs> hey. Jeez. Ruins. Let's see what they've got. Honky Tonk Armageddon. Club a girl rolling hard on that E at this rave remixes. Someone's very excited to be out on a school night. Is it drugs? It is drugs. Grimothy gives Flair a high five. High five, That's Grim. eight times now. Grimothy. Oh, hey, it's that band. What band? You know. You remember this song. Had that video that people posted like a zillion times. I have literally no idea what you're talking about. It had that weird horse in it. <laughs> oh, yeah, I remember. Had a weird horse in it. Oh god, that horse was all... <laughs> okay. I remember. Yep, we have officially remembered that video. We did it. Pepperidge Farm remembers. Alright. Pepperidge Farm remembers. I spent so much time in malls as like a teenager. Exit. Look at that big, dark, empty parking lot. Yeah, not sure if it's ever been filled. There aren't enough people in the whole town. It's like a big black ocean with a fish tastic on the other side. Oh shit! I got a weird fever from eating that fish tastic. Fish tastic. 
I spent a lot of time in Walmart. There wasn't much to do in my hometown, and Walmart was open 24 7. I had, uh, um, I had a girlfriend in college that was from a really small town. And that Rimothy was like what people did. They went to Walmart. Special taco poops, complete with all circuits and Diablo sauce, into the mystical bag of holding. It's sure to be a spicy surprise. I thought I was from a small town growing up until I met her and visited her small town a bunch of times. And then I was like, oh shit, I was, I'm was i basically a city kid compared to this. How small was her small town? And yours? Mine was probably like 3,000 people. Hers was like 500. Mine was like 16k when I was growing up, but it's bigger now. Oh shoot, lol. If I had but mine was like, I'd it was in an area, like, like my, my high school had 3,000 people then, in it, because it was a feeder school for the whole county. So it was like, it wasn't... I was like in the suburbs, basically. But like, her, her town was like, it was maybe more like 1,500 or something, but it was oh, like, sure. literally gotcha. everybody knew everybody's business. Everybody knew everybody in town. Everybody knew everybody's cousins and aunts and all of their fucking business. It was like so weird. I grew up in a suburb of the Twin Cities. Well, her town was in between there and where I grew up, which is like near Kenosha, Wisconsin. Black, My high school Black had River less Falls. than 500 students. I knew a lot of people because of my dad's bakery. Let's check out the rest of them all first. Yeah, let's eat. Let's eat. What did you get? You inhaled it before I got a look. Pizza taco from Gopher. Pierogi burger from Smelt Burger. That's just a big pile of carbs and meat, huh? Isn't that what we are? Bones, too. I don't want bones in my burger. <laughs> Remember when Kathy Domenko pulled out Candy Clark's nose ring here? You know what that was about, right? Wasn't Kathy pregnant with what's his name, football guy? Ron Boonstra. I didn't know you knew about that. Well, I mean, there was the first football game of our senior year, and Ron ran up to the sideline and yelled at the stands, My first touchdown's for my beautiful firstborn and his mommy, Kathy Domingo. That's something. Kathy was in marching band, and she was crying, I think. Then he dumped her for Cindy a week later. Oh yeah, see, that's the part I knew about. That's what set off the whole nose ring situation. I wonder what Kathy's mom's... I wonder what Kathy's up to now. I wonder what Ron's doing. I wonder what happened to Cindy. I imagine she got a new nose ring. <laughs> or conversely, never wanting a nose ring ever again. You know what the worst part of the story is? The sordid high school drama. Cindy having something ripped out of her face. Ron. At the time, I was like, God moves things around in the strangest ways to bring two people together. Well, it used to make things make more sense, at least. Thinking about this place, the fountain, the guide walkway and stuff. Not knowing how something worked seemed like magic. Now knowing it means it might be going wrong, I may not be able to fix it. Help knowing someone was in control. Now I'm just tired all the time from the shop. When I was at school, ah, uh, yeah, I don't even want to talk about it. What happened anyway? You want to run around the mall some more? Uh, there's not really much else to run around. We can check out the weird bad art upstairs. I want to touch it. Please don't. I want to run. You run. I'm going to sit here. I'm tired and sad now. Can I go in the bookstore? How come I can never interact with books? I want to go to the bookstore. 
Oh wow, is this? Hehe, <laughs> hee hee. Fantastic. See if I can get him again on the way past. Someone's gonna call the cops. <laughs> Beatrice sent it. <laughs> Don't give me it. Beatrice Jones. Oh wow, is that you? <laughs> is that you, God? Yes, it is I, God Stevenson. <laughs> I didn't know you had a last name. Silence, mortal. Through my fish monster have lain waste to your kind. I'm not gonna lie, that was pretty magical. Silence! I shan't say it again. You and your good and noble companion shall get ice cream on the way home. Ha ha ha, yeah, we should probably get out of here. Before you're arrested. Ah. The cops shall be confused and stuff and beat each other up. For I am God and I hate the cops. <laughs> okay, okay, get down here. Have a good one, mortal. That was great. Because it's not sticking to the man. The man isn't going to lose anything here. But she will get in a lot of trouble. She's just a cog in a much bigger machine, huh? Sure, whatever. Return the ship. Okay, okay, I'm going. Hi. Hello. You're back. Yeah, we stole some shit. Here's that shit. We didn't want you to get in trouble with your boss. It's not your fault the world is like it is. What? You stole this? this? Game is great. You're just a cog in a much bigger machine. To blame you would be like blaming a thing inside a whole thing. So you're returning stolen merchandise? One day folks like you are going to overthrow the whole thing. What whole thing? The whole thing. We're leaving. Stay strong, you beautiful dreamer. You have nothing to lose but your chains. What? <laughs> place used to be something. It's still something. Nah, just a big, mostly empty thing. In a big, mostly empty parking lot. Well, you work with what you have. Let's never come here again. Don't have to convince me. I only came here because you wanted to. Well, Fort Lucene used to be something. Now Fort Lucene's over. Let's go. Let's let it die in peace. Let it die. I want to drive on the way home. Nope. Yeah, this game's great. It's so, like, weird. It, there's, like... It's silly. It's nothing. It's, like, it's nothing and it's fun. It's so funny. But, nope. Dad, move the boxes in the crawl space. What's up, Dad? I heard you had a wild time last night. I didn't drink. It works better if you let me accuse you first. Right. Here's my hangover cure. Not drinking the night before. Wow. Hold on, let me write that down. <laughs> it's complicated, I know. Good one, Dad. What'd you do tonight? Went out with B. You had a good time? Yeah, she's kind of, I don't know. Like, she's older, like much older. And kind of sad. She's been through a lot. Well, she lost her mom. Hey, Dad, would you mind moving the boxes in the crawl space? Well, what have you done for me lately? 
been a credit to this family. That doesn't count. Well, would you watch some TV with me? Yeah. Hop up, I'm watching Garbo and Malloy. <laughs> nice. Welcome back, folks. Hell of a show tonight. Say Malloy. Yes, Garbo? Ever get the feeling that disaster's right around the corner? Sure do, right before we start the show every night. You superstitious, Garbo? Not anymore. What happened? I've broken every mirror I've ever owned. Now I'm lucky enough to never have to look at this mug. <laughs> yeah, but what about the rest of us? Coming up next, Garbo and I join a cult. Why is the, started a cult. the mom never around? It's a pickle and blue cheese cult. Hmm. Like, in as part of the same bite? I'd try it. Like both of those things. Not together. Just liking both things. I had a... I made like a... I made a salad the other day that had just ass loads of blue cheese on it. It was dank. Blue cheese and dried cranberries and pecans and bacon. That's the correct amount of blue cheese. And ranch dressing and lettuce. I hope we didn't make too much of a mess with the fountain. It was me. I was merely sitting there when I was assaulted with malt water. I will not rest until that fountain is brought to justice. Have Tell you tried world. Bubby's pickles? No. I don't think. Maybe. I got some, like, fresh pickles at Costco. Is that what it is? If you haven't, you should. They are my all-time favorite pickles. No. Bubby's Pickles. Okay. Um, my favorite pickles I've ever had. There was this restaurant. There was a sandwich place in San Francisco the bread and called butter Snacking Pickles. Oh, bread and you butter can get pickles. Them at Target. I do not like bread and butter pickles. But maybe I've never had good ones. I generally, only Try like deal. I promise. All right. Fair enough. I've I've agreed with most of your other opinions and stuff so <laughs> every person who has said that that i've had try them likes them all right there were um there was a sandwich shop in san francisco called deli board just ridiculous sandwiches they're like at this point i bet they're 25 dollars sandwiches but it is what it is they had pickles and he said he got the pickles from chicago somewhere and they were they were called half sour that's a lot for a sandwich. Well, yeah, it's it's San Francisco. It's like everything's ridiculous. To be fair, each sandwich is like three meals. They're like, well, to be fair, this big. To be fair, to be fair. And there's probably like two pounds of meat in each one. They're amazing sandwiches. But yeah, it was like I was, you know, I was working in San Francisco. I it was it was easy easily spent twenty five twenty thirty dollars on lunch every day ridiculous but awesome pickles okay that's, awesome. that's not so bad and but um pickles they were called half sours and I've never found them they were like they were they basically tasted like dill pickles but they weren't super pickled they were like fresher then like you know kind of like a Clausen where they're like refrigerated and they're like they're real crispy there's still very much there's still a lot of cucumber there 
and not so much vinegar and salt. Oh, so they're yeah. new pickles. Yeah, because like old pickles old get pickles. all kind of bendy and floppy, and these are like nice and crunchy and not super hard on the vinegar and dill. They were called half sours, and they were awesome. And I wish I could find them. That's awesome! Fresh pickles. Yum. This must be B. I don't... Or maybe Arthur. Uh, what's his name? What's the guy? What's this This guy's? Greg's boyfriend. This one's B. This one's Greg. What's the guy's name? Hi. Hi. I'm not going to play more Demon Tower. That'll be an off-stream thing, probably. Oh, stop. There was a sandwich shop where I went to college that had incredible Spice fresh pickles are good too. Pickles. There was a sandwich shop in Madison. I went to college in Madison. And there was um oh, another weird ass dream. There was this sandwich shop called Radical Rye and it was so good and they like Good sandwich. Um, and I remember it was like the kind of place where you get like a little sheet and you fill out like you want this kind of bread and these toppings and whatever and you hand them the sheet and then they make your sandwich. And they also had like epic Every salads. But I remember sandwiches with like I would order sprouts on the sandwich and it was like I don't know it was awesome. Something about it. That's awesome! Tuba dude. Cowabunga! Sprouts are so underrated. Yeah. I need to just grow them. They're really easy to grow. You like make them like a fucking chia pet. And then just eat them. <laughs> you grow them in little jars or whatever. I always see a bunch of like Pinterest crap about growing sprouts yourself, and I never do it. But I should do it, because I love sprouts, and I never buy them, because it seems like they're always overpriced. I didn't know that hog. I think they're really easy to grow. This is pretty cool. This game is so weird. I, I, I'm enjoying it. What's this? There's with me in the background there. This, this jam is legit. The accordion really sealed the deal. It really did. What am I missing? Once again, the sound design is spectacular. It's just wonderful, yeah. There's this dude over here. Let's see. I think I lit all the lanterns. There was like something down here that's obviously like a little shadowy person, but 
It's not letting me do anything. Maybe there's a lantern missing still. Oh, there we go. What heck? See how much my what controller is vibrating. Crazy. What a game. What a game. <laughs> yeah, that was wild. I feel like the person who designed this game smokes a lot of pot. <laughs> right. Working day if you want to say hello. Yep, that's my life right there. All right. Morning. Working today. Angus is out of town and I'm lonely. Okay, bye. We got to go hang out with Greg. All right. Go talk to mom, most likely. I wonder if dad moved the boxes. Nope. There she is. Spill it, Mom. There's a big sinkhole two streets over. Are we still getting those? I don't think those ever really go away. Swampy ground pickles. and so forth on a floodplain. Right on. I don't want you over there nosing around it. I guarantee you I won't. Ha I haven't seen sinkholes. No interest at all. Mom, they're just holes in the ground. Get back to me when one, like, swallows a house or something. We'll go see together if that happens. Deal. So what'd you do last night? Went to the mall with B. Oh, Fort seen? Yeah. Haven't been there in years. How is it? Kind of falling apart and empty. Yeah, I expect. Everyone just goes to the outlet stores up by the interstate now for, you know, shoes and things. Well, stop by the church if you're in the area. Will do, Mom. Bye, sweetie. All right. Now you've been home for a few days, yeah? Have you thought about getting a G? Well, I gotta go, Mom. All right. Oh, it's like uh, a little rainy. Or something. This person may be us. We all know how important it is to look our best. What? Our appearance is first and sometimes last impression we make. Selmers, did you join a cult? Lucky for you, I happen to be a licensed dealer. Okay, of the Sylvan family of products. Selmers, I don't have any money. Okay. Have you sold anything yet? Sold some to my mom and to Abby Krangler. Ms. Krangler's daughter? Granddaughter. I ran into her at the laundromat over by the school. One time Greg got locked inside one of the tumble dryers. <laughs> Did he die? He wanted me to start it, but I chickened out. He definitely would have died. <laughs> Tell him that. He's still mad. Want to hear a poem? Sure. Sometimes, I think. And I start to sink. Oh no. There's more. Sorry. <laughs> then I remember. It's October. October? I combined my two favorite months. Fall is really nice. Bob remembers. It's the best. Days are going to start getting shorter soon. It makes me sad. I like it. I love the fall, but I hate the dark. I like it. You sure do. Alright. That guy's cool. My cat don't like folks on the porch. <laughs> I'm not supposed to be up here. But how 
what else am I gonna get up here? Ooh, rule breaker flare. See, I just leave my laundry out on rainy days. It's like a cheap wash. Give me that acorn. No? Alright, let's go in the sewer, see if that lady has anything else to say. See if I can steal it. Oh, the fisherman guy is gone. These gummy worms aren't very good. That sucks. Nope, she's not here. These dudes are here though. Rainy day, huh? Not down here. You kids have your own little secret hideout down here, huh? <laughs> whatever. When I was a kid, literally nobody cares. Well, whatever. Okay then. Little shits. I have a uh, Costco tub of Sour Patch rope like they're like little licorices like this long but they're sour patch it's oh my god i'm so jealous i like one night like a couple weeks ago i ate like 30 of them <laughs> i got like mouth sores <laughs> i love sour candy i love it too I prefer fruity or sour candy to chocolate candy anytime. I don't dislike chocolate. I just would I would rather eat a bag of Skittles than Same here. a piece of chocolate or whatever, you know. The mini golf ice cream palace. Petting zoo. Petting zoo, yeah. One hundred percent. I have the same preference and people never understand it. Yeah, people are like, you don't like chocolate? You're crazy. I'm like, I don't dislike chocolate. I'll eat chocolate if it's in front of me. But... Nothing? Nothing, lady? Okay. I don't dislike it, but I never really crave chocolate. Yeah. Ladies, gents, and envy friends, don't same. forget to check out Blair's blog and say, show me your box. It's wet and I'm cold. The smelters wouldn't say that. Hell no, smelters play it any weather. Come rain or come shine, it's always smelter weather. Mm -hmm. These guys. <laughs> Dudes at the bar just talking about the local sports team. Okay, let's talk to Greg. Oh, this... Excuse me. Yeah. I'm looking for the park store. You just missed it. The what? One is totally You've got an accent. Where are you from? Russia. How did you end up all the way out here? I'm hiking the Great Eastern Deciduous Trail. Did you see any bears? Not so far. <sighs> they eat people sometimes. Actually, all of your bears around here mostly eat garbage. Rude. <laughs> My guide said there was a park store here. It's gone. It used to be right here. But now there's a snack falcon. Do you know where I can get some supplies? I mean, snack falcon, dude. I guess I can find something in there. I mean, they got all kinds of cool stuff. Probably all perishable, though. Hmm. Isn't everything perishable? We're all going to perish. Everything is going to perish. But yeah, they've got granola bars, I think. Spasibo. What's spasibo? Thanks. Ooh, Russian. Greg. Hey, hey, May May. Totally, what's up, dude? I was thinking about going to jail. Greg. Like, you're planning on going? I think I could break out. Maybe I should, like, test my skills of escape. I feel like the risk is bigger than any possible reward. Yeah. What brought this up? I had a nightmare about going to jail. My cousin went to jail. 
My other cousin Jen said it was inevitable. Oh man, you're not inevitable. I mean, it's not inevitable. No, go back. I am definitely inevitable. The inevitable Greg. Is Angus around today? Nah, he's off doing some stuff. What stuff? Family stuff. They're not worth talking about. Yeesh. You wanna hang out? Yes. Damn straight. Mechanics. What do we got? What do we got? The bullet went clean through. You can still see the bullet hole in it. How did that not kill him? Must have missed all the important parts of the brain. Wow. Yeah, great great granddad was pretty tough. But isn't that the helmet the fascists were wearing? No, wrong war. And wrong country. These weren't the bad guys. Read some history. No. Jeez, okay. Ads are running real quick. I'm gonna put Peabot up and go get a beverage of some sort. One that I will probably choke on. I'll be right back. Hey chat, welcome in. Get cozy and stay fabulous. Heads up, ads incoming. Grab a snack or stretch those legs. Stick around, you won't miss any action. Ads for more info. You'll only choke on it if I make an ill-timed joke again. Otherwise, you'll be fine. Challenge accepted, but remember, my jokes are always perfectly timed. If you choke, it's just my way of keeping you on your toes. sour pickles now. Go for it. Half sour pickles are delicious and worth the effort. Plus, nothing beats the taste of homemade pickles. never made pickles before, that would be fun but learning to can food isn't a cheap hobby. Canning can be pricey to start, but it's a rewarding hobby. Plus, think of all the tasty, snarky pickles you'll have. Right, Peabot. It's worth it for the pickles. Anything is worth it for pickles. Exactly. Pickles are life. Dive into the pickle making adventure. Your taste buds will thank you. Just saying, enjoy the brine time. Instead of what would you do for a Klondike bar, mine is what would you do for a pickle. What would I do for a pickle? Join a rock band, skydive into a volcano, or even compliment Buttspot. Pickles are worth it. Or even compliment Buttspot. <laughs> Rip Buttspot. No compliment Buttspot Peabot. I don't believe you. Blair, are you ready to jump back into the action after the break? Uh huh. That's why I pushed that button. I'll mail Blair a jar of pickles if you compliment Buttspot. All right, you got me there. Buttspot, you. Uh, sure have a buttload of dedication. Now, where's my jar of pickles? <laughs> you sure you want a rip from Buttspot? People kept saying it was a fascist house. So what are we doing? You up for a crime? Boy, am I ever. I mean, I kind of did some last night. Oh, really? Without me? Aw, oh, dude. You're always my number one crime, Fred. That's beautiful, dude. Likewise. So what's the 
plan. Follow me. Yes, dear leader. I am both a leader and a deer. Ranger cleared up. Weather if moves I can find for us. A place to buy bubbies online, so what do I need the bat job. for? Ta-da! Ooh la la. F that car up, Private Borovsky. So, you brought me out here to watch me beat up a car? Why? Do you need a reason? No, but I'd like one. Fair. So we need the battery out of this car. What for? That's privileged info, Private. <clears throat> I can get some at Target. That's okay. If, if they have it, we go to Target all the time. Private. I'm a general, at least. No, I'm the general. I got a hat. War is stupid. Watch it. War got me this hat. Okay, but what if someone needs this car? I think it's say some no one's gonna miss it. It'll be in the fridge section by sandwich meat and stuff like that. Okay. I guess it's got a tree growing through it. So we're just beating until the hood pops open. Yeah, just smash it up. Smash capitalism. Smash the government. Smash this car. Yarg. The final blow. Excellent work. You want to do the honors? I'm going to get electric. Am I going to get electrocuted? Should be fine. <laughs> Car's got a tree growing through it. Probably not electric anymore. Wait, but do you want to do it or not? I do. Get, get, get out of here. Get, get. What's... <laughs> Did I just die? <laughs> Sharkle. Hey, Sharkle, what are you doing here? You've always been a good friend, May. The good times, the bad times, the porn yeah. adware fiasco. That weekend, you tried to change the operating system? You're right, we have been through a lot together. Sharkle, am I dead? Yes. No. Oh, that's good. I have things to do. You must go back. You're meant for great things. Really? Not really, no. Oh. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie here. I appreciate it. This is awkward. Don't feel bad, Sharkle. <laughs> what? <laughs> Dude. This is so stupid. This is hilarious. <laughs> Ugh. Oh shit. You okay? I think I died. How long was I out? Like five seconds? Oh, weird. Time like stretches. It's a mysterious universe. Time does go all wibbly wobbly sometimes. We go, we good to go with the battery? You know it. Let's get back to the apartment. I taste pennies. <laughs> And anyway, even if it was a fascist fascist helmet, it's got an anarchy symbol on it now, which makes it good. And there's a bullet hole in it. So whoever was wearing it is dead. And I'm like wearing the trophy. So you admit that it's a fascist helmet. <laughs> no, I don't. Okay, okay. So what are we doing? Okay, so wait, question, shoot. What the hell is that? The thing? Yes, obviously the thing. Remember those big, like, robot cartoon characters they used to have at the Food Donkey? I do. Oh my god, is that one of them? Are we gonna put one together? 
Dude, we totally are. Where the hell did you get it? You know Steve Scriggins? The guy who locked that substitute teacher in the supply closet? The guy who drove little circles around people in the school parking lot? He was stuck in there over the longest night break. Survived by eating glue and Spanish workbooks. Steve Scriggins gave you this? Yeah, that guy. He's horrible, man. But he's been hanging out at the food dog he's been shut down, and he dug it out for me. This is the first useful thing Steve has ever done. Okay, 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 what do we do? Get this old battery into that old thing. Straightforward enough? Kinda. It's full of garbage. It's too bad you didn't cut yourself on it and get a disease. It's too bad you didn't die on the way here. It's too bad the robot wasn't filled with angry snakes. And they killed you. It's too bad the elevator didn't fall and squash you like a pancake. Oh no, dude, that's a phobia. That's one that makes sense, at least. What are we doing again? Oof, this thing smells. That's just how old machines smell. No, like, I think something was living in here. Hey, I've got an idea. Why don't you stop being so negative? Why don't you eat your own neck? <laughs> That's impossible. <laughs> Be serious. This is serious business. Oh well. Don't mind me. See, I've already died once tonight. No big deal or anything. What was it like? I saw a shark, I think. I can taste my tooth fillings and it's like they're ringing. Like little bells inside my skull. Wow. Yeah. Okay, let's do this. Clamp it. Uh, let me look at something real quick. Bum, 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 bum. Okay. Glitchy Bastards gives Flair a high five. That's 34 times now. High five. Just because he died for like a whole five seconds? Dude, come on. Some people have been dead like forever. Do you see them whining? <laughs> um, right. They either shut up and deal or they become ghosts. Are you saying I should become a ghost? Yeah, Carpe Diem. Carpe Diem. Carpe Diem sounds like a fish. A fish that tells you to live your damn life. <laughs> okay, fine. Now's the best part. We're gonna put this beast together. Do you know how to get how it goes together? Gonna find out. Cool. May. Sorry. Cool. Awoo. Awoo. The fish bit reminds me of Moo Point from Friends. <laughs> Moo Point. Yeah. Here are all the parts. Wow. So many possible combinations. We can create our own unique metal offspring. So we just clank these together. Yeah, slap them together, tighten some screws. What could go wrong? I mean, quite a lot. Lots of stuff. Was that a ghost noise? Yeah. Hmm. So Okay good. I thought I was hearing things for a second. Oh, okay.
can I take this part? Oh, okay, hold on. Straightforward. Let's see. Got like a bottle. I guess I don't need this part. Maybe I should... beautiful boy our robot son it's like this is pretty great and all it reminded me why did we just put a bunch of garbage together in your living, your living room and connect it to a stolen car battery that's already leaking acid on the carpet i think i don't know since you've been back in town i think i missed greg of a few years ago like these days i mostly work all the time but why are you working so much we got plans what plans bright harbor bright harbor since when a uh, year or so now. That's why we're working like seven days a week. But when are you moving? I think in the spring? That's like a few months away. Yeah. Oh, okay. You should come visit when we settle in. Library Hammer. Oh, May, it's so cool. We visited in the summer. There's like record stores and weird bars and everyone's cool and like free. That's where I got my tattoo. sheep. Yep. Why a sheep? The tattoo guy was like all the way hot and it didn't even hurt. You have a tattoo. You're moving to Bright Harbor. Yeah. Oh, okay. All right. Anyway, like I was saying, now that you're back in Possum Springs, I was like, hey, let's do some crimes again. Aw, dude. So I was thinking about how to use that for like good. So I thought I'd bring this here for Angus. That's beautiful, dude. I'm sure he'll love it. I hope so. Okay, so yeah, let's turn it on. I want to push the button. Let me push the button. Let me do it. Dude, it's the least I could do for my best friend back from the dead. Pizza party next time I die and come back. Dude, that's such a deal. Oh god, this side smells even worse. I hope whatever was living here in this hole... Oh, I think I see it. Push it, push it, push it. Oh, 
Push it, push it, push it. Okay, okay, okay. okay. Get it. Get it. Yep. Meh. Meh. It's like the third time <laughs> she's been electrocuted. I knew it. <laughs> it lives. It's got an. What the? I had a feeling that was gonna happen. That's too funny. <laughs> Hey Angus, how's it going, May? Good, I didn't die this time. You? Good, good. I'm just gonna lay here for a while if that's okay. <laughs> I've mined, I've ran machines, but now I get to slice sticks and hawk salamis. I mean, it's easier on the back, that's for sure. Do you like it? I like having a paycheck. Fair. Paychecks. The sweetest meats of all. What'd you do tonight? Oh, you know. Stuff. Tired. Feel like I just did a day's work. You know, there are places you can get paid for work these days. Oh, really? Yeah, they call it working. Huh. You kids with your slang. Slang you could pick up at work. Oh, yes. Point made. Wait. What about those boxes I asked about in the crawl space? Hmm, I'm thinking about it. Watch some TV with me? Of course. Of course, Dad. Garbo and Malloy is starting. Ah, uh, yes. Ah, uh, yes. You know we like to get political here. Gotta do it. Gotta. You hear about all this new law in the books. Pirating a movie online. You know about that? I do. Punishable by up to ten years in prison. Wow. Here I've been trying to get in the hard way. He has, folks. I wonder if pirating a movie about first-degree murder earns you more prison respect than one about grand larceny. Hey, Malay, you know what I think about that law? What, Garbo? That's a WAPA. Coming out next. I didn't see. Stupid something. Stupid sandwiches. Stupid sandwiches. <laughs> Sometimes it's hard to go upstairs. There we go. How about the crawl space? Still got boxes? Yep. I don't know what's in the crawl space, but. I'm, like, real curious at this point. Books. Nope. Up we go. Check the computer. And hey, you were like, sure I am. What's up? Nothing watching TV. What are you watching? It's a true crime show. Is it any good? No. The reenactment is terrible. But they, if they were good, I'd actually feel... As it stands, it's just like bad local commercial actors. <clears throat> Pretending to murder or be murdered. I love those shows. They're the best. Hey, punk. Are you still electric? No, I think it's gone now. Hold on, let me touch something metal. Okay, I touched my futon frame and we're good. Good work, Dr. Science. Does Angus like the robot? I think so. He's just kind of looking at it. Hold on, I'll ask him. Okay, he says to say thank you, so I think that means he likes it. All right, Duder, I'm turning in. Me too, see you later. Hey, May, are you all right? I was afraid you were really hurt, and you left so quickly. I'm good, big guy. Okay, just want to make sure. I appreciate it. Try not to almost die anymore tonight. No promises. Hi. Hi. <laughs> Sharky guy is pretty great. All right, what's next? I'd probably do one more, one more day, and then 
pick it up pick it up again tomorrow. I don't know how long this game is. But I'm doing it this tonight and tomorrow. And then this is a really fun game to watch. Um then hunt drops start on Friday. So Friday stream and then Sunday and Monday next week and then then Friday after that is all going to be hunt because it drops. And it's a shame it, it'd be a shame to not take the opportunity to to stream a game that I like streaming when there's drops on, so it is what it is. But then after that, if I if I'm, I think I might be able to finish this between tonight and tomorrow. I don't think it's a very long game. But if not, then I will continue this after hot uh, drops or holy shit after hunt drops are done. And then, I don't know what's next. Firewatch, I think, based on that poll. Which is a pretty short game. I think I can do that in one stream if it's like, it may be a late stream though. Or I might break it in half. Because it's only about a five, five, six hour game. Oh, it's another one of these. Wonderful. Is kind of a banger. Yeah. Once again, music in the game kicking ass. There we go. Get the accordion guy back. Nice. Like up here? No. Am I done? I can't tell. Hard to say. Last time it ended when I found those like four pillars together. I 
I saw that here already, but I don't remember where. Here's another one. Was missing tuba. There's like a place where there's like four little crystal pillars or something. That's where it ended last time, but I don't... I can't find it this time. I think it's somewhere in the middle. Yeah. I get up on the house over here. I thought I saw a platform or something you hadn't been on a while ago, but now I don't yeah. know where it was. I was thinking this. I think it was down from the power lines. Hmm. Yeah, here we go. There we go. Fucking flashbang. robot smells a little weird not sure what we missed there anyway hey boyo at work all day very bored work sucks crap falcon more like it Move the stuff. 
Nope. Go talk to mom. Okay, yeah, just been doing boring adult stuff. Kind of adult stuff. I'm adult stuff. Just like budget, bills, numbers, a lot of adults that is number stress. It sounds bad, I'm bad at numbers. Oh, I remember. Okay, well I'm gonna head out. Mm-hmm. Have a nice day. Numbers, numbers, numbers. Poor mom. Alright. Gonna go try to find B. You know what's good? Off the top of my head, not falling in a trash can and the puking on yourself. Ball is so pretty. Yeah, not seriously injuring someone during your first kiss at senior prom. I was gonna say those fruit snack thingies we used to eat in grade school. All oh, right, yeah, those are really good. Did that other thing happen to you? <laughs> nope. Want to hear a new poem? Sure. Sometimes I like fruit snacks out by the train tracks. Decent. A juice box and headphones. I enter the juice zone. Geez, those are like all I want now. You made them sound so real. I can taste the atomic dino snacks and the full clear squeezer. gonna make my dog anxious and she poops a lot <laughs> when she's anxious <laughs> hey who's this I don't poop when I'm anxious right let's go see if that lady wants to talk about grandpa again oh the fisherman Wife long gone, kids don't care, tunnel fish are always there. Haha, <laughs> yeah man. Oh god, please don't listen. <laughs> man, I wish there was a pierogi stand. I did find a pierogi restaurant in town, and they're legit. But it's super fucking far away, it's like a... 30 minute drive. <sighs> Something about a tide rolling out. What? Oh, right. That was a metaphor. I figured back then there were places that brought us all together, or at least brought us together in bits and bits. Bobs, the old Smokies, the Grand Bears, the Lodge of Old, the Church and the Union. There'd be dances up at the HB. That's where I met your granddad. Oh, a lifetime ago. <laughs> what was he like back then? Plain in most respects, prone to fits of melancholy, but funny and wild when the occasion called. Surprising is, I guess, the word. Hmm. I have a cousin who lives in San nice. Francisco, and she lives near this really great Eastern European restaurant. What'd your daddy say about it? They him? have super good pierogies there. Distant but trying? Sounds right. That sounds... You are right, Miss Rosa? Oh yes. Let's talk another time. Okay. Hope you feel better. Oh may. Oh dear may. Are there people over here? Nope. CJ, you were like in high school when I was in middle school. Oh, huh. Did I know you? You used to play nerd games with Tom Bramlow across the street from my house. Haha, <laughs> nerd games. That's quite a memory you got there. Do you live here anymore? Nah, just back visiting. For nerd games? 
They were like pen and paper role playing stuff. Cool. But no, I'm just visiting family. Husband's driving down tomorrow. What do you do now, lawyer? Oh, wow. Can I ask you some law stuff? Well, I'm not acting in a professional capacity, professional capacity, but yeah, sure. What's the best way to get out of jail? Well, it depends on the situation. You see, like, would you dig through the wall or, like, attack a guard and take their pants and identity or, like, I don't know, just cause a riot or something? Huh. What's the best prison gang? Like, if you had to pick. <laughs> you know, we don't really learn this kind of stuff in law school. What's the point of going to college? You don't learn useful stuff. Useful my ass, CJ. Sorry. Welcome back. Have a nice visit. Bye. Video outpost is... There's never anything to do in here. Oh, he's actually working. Hey, May. Got a pretty good horror section. You got a favorite? What? A horror movie? Yeah. Scythe Sabbath. Black Oaks. I'm going with Scythe Sabbath. Ooh, Italian. <laughs> yeah. Bye. Death Chill. Alright. Um, we're gonna go find B. Party Barn. Prime Waves was my other stripper alias in college. <laughs> hey, dude. Hello. How's working here going? Eh, I don't know. It pays. Hey, May. How's the pickaxe? Trying to kill me? Unsuccessfully, thus far at least. What's so stressful? Well, on top of everything else, we're hosting that stupid harvest play tomorrow. Oh, wow. Yeah, I'm never offering to do this again. What are you up to tonight? Nothing. I'm like super tired because everything about my life is ex exhausting. I'm doing the work of three employees plus a store owner, even though I'm the one employee and I do not own the store. Weird. I thought for some reason you own this place now. You'd think, but also no. I'd rather die. Literally make me a coffin using materials and tools from this store. <laughs> and bury me anywhere else. Jeez, that got intense. Anyway, I'm doing nothing tonight. I can do nothing too. Fine. So are we doing this? Let's hang out. Hi, P. Hi, May. Hi, Germ. Hey, dude. Germ's helping me move stuff for under the table cash. Well, I'm knocking off work early to pick up some groceries. Wanna come? Yes. Ready to go. You got a lot of hammers. Holy shit, there's so many kinds of nails. <laughs> He's like something out of a children's book about whatever the hell he is. Dinner at Bees. So I think like the choices about who you pick to hang out with might make a difference. I don't really know. This place killed the food donkey. Food. You know, no one who works here had anything to do with it. Donkey! He sure showed Ham Panther corporate who's boss. Actually, do you know our senator is on the Ham Panther board or something? You know you're zero fun, right? I do know that, yes. Okay. You can grab a few things quick. We are hanging out. I'm just here to grab something for dinner for Dad and me. Don't feel like doing the big shop tonight. Let me pick out what we have. Oh, I'm sorry. Are you coming to dinner? Can I? Um, I guess. Are you asking? I wasn't. But now it feels weird not to. I'll pick out what we eat then. Wait, you're serious? Yeah. You know what? Go for it. I hate shopping. I need, like, a main course and two sides. What counts as a main course? We can stop back in the meat section once you pick out whatever else. What about dessert? We're not children. Appetizer? We're on a budget, May. 
Okay, okay, okay. You hang out and I'll be right back. Just make it quick and not too horrible. Also, Dad's sensitive to broccoli. No shoplifting this time. Ah. I can afford a few groceries, May. Also, this place has cameras. Good point. Alright. Green beans. Tash? What the hell is Tash? Is that like a chicken? Get your meat first, I say. Cool sides. Quick quick skits, biscuits, cream greens. Should I get bakey shaky? That goes well with meat. Yes. I don't know if that is a shake and bake. I think we're going to get the meat after. And green beans, shake and bake. What's this fucking thing? I think I'm gonna go with the purple can with like the chicken head on it. Is it cream of chicken soup? No. Greeny beanies? No. Succotash. Succotash, a mac and cheese, tasty taters. Mashed potatoes. Creamed spinach. Fuck it. Creamed spinach, mashed potatoes, shake and bake. What is succotash? Is that like a Get an eggplant dish. What was all the way here? Oh, huh? okay. It's corn, actually. Hmm. Oh, yeah. Ahoy there, ladies. Just me and the meats. Meat friends. Helps to stay friendly with your prime cuts and best fishes. Still weird seeing you here. Beats the alternatives. I think I saw my old music teacher when we came in. Oh yeah, that was Mr. Armistead. Looks like it's his job to say hello to people. Yep, call the greeter. Check out Flair's lit YouTube channel Just to learn all about streaming. Grabbing something for dinner. It's fire. How's your dad? All right. What can I get for you? What did I get? I got green beans and I got shake and bake. Shake and bake is a uh, pork chops, maybe. Yep. At the ham pan at home, May. I'll grill us up something nice. We can chop up just about anything back here. Pork chops, green beans, mashed potatoes. Shake and bake? You need help? Shake and bake. And I helped. <laughs> I 
shake and bake. And I help. Okay, I'm going to be done after this night. Yeah, we're all paid up till the 15th next month. All right. That rock salt sorted. Yeah, should be fine. Rob's still driving that big rig as far as I know. Succotash usually corn. Lima beans are other beans. Tomatoes, okra, bell peppers. That sounds Instead great, of it, like most actually. Foods, it's kind of whatever you want to put in. <laughs> Vegetable medley. Lucky mo. Bad time. Have a great time. Later, PJ. Thanks for stopping by. That's how retro works. So I've got a question. Mm -hmm. What exactly does your dad do at the store? Your dad's kind of up and down, huh? He has good days and bad days. Often I'm the same day. Greg's always been like that too. Just more uh, zany. Well, Greg is probably bipolar. Gee, thanks Dr. B. Whereas my dad is having a years long breakdown. You run the whole store now, right? More or less. Yeah, but it's still his name on everything. Yep. And meanwhile, you're running basically everything. Yep. And, and, working there every day. Yep. I just think you shouldn't. Okay. just think you're selling yourself. I would probably just quit. Or, like, take over the store. Like, you not doing anything about it just reinforces. Is this really the road you want to go down with this? Saying you should stand up for yourself or just quit. I'm saying it's not right that you just roll over and take. Oh, go to hell. Here's some reality for you. You know Creek? Repair guy Creek at the shop? Yeah, you met him when we were kids. When I was 15, he asked my dad if he could teach me how to drive. My dad said no, and then told me not to be alone with him. Yeah, exactly. And you know what? He still works for us. Why haven't you fired him? I can't fire people. And even if I could, he's on the crew. And frankly, he's our best guy. Practically heads up the repair team. Since my dad's barely doing anything, and Creek's got a family, he needs to work. I'm gonna be sick. Yeah, me too. I'm really familiar with that feeling. I'm saying if you keep letting these dudes off the hook, like you're stronger than this bee, you're like badass and shit. My mom dying was not very badass. Me sitting in this room right now is not very badass. Okay, sorry. You're such a shithead, you know that? A lot of times people do the things they do because they can't do anything else. You always have a choice. You can always choose. 
says the child woman with no job, no rent, no responsibilities, and no consequences for your stupid actions. I'm seriously going to punch your goddamn lights out. You come in here and start telling me how I'm screwing things up. You want to come in here and say, oh yeah, I just did your dad, who is both getting old and can barely get off the couch half the time. You want to come in here and say, oh yeah, I just start this big drama and make your life way more stressful. That's not what I'm saying. What are you saying then? I don't know anymore. Like, Greg is probably off doing God knows what wacky shit right now. I'm here making dinner and doing payroll. You know nothing about my life. You just know what I should do, and you're the last person I'd ask for advice. Okay, okay, I'm sorry. Yeah, you're sorry. Everyone's sorry, but you don't get it. You're just like the other the night, but this all the got time. very serious. Yeah, right? Running around messing with people, taking whatever you want. Well, the whole mall is falling apart around you. I thought you had a good time. I should go. You should go. Well, okay then. Pork's okay. Pork will do. <laughs> yeah, that got pretty dark. Okay, we're home. Watch TV do with Dad. Oof, what's up? Long day. How's socializing? Surprisingly tiring sometimes. Yeah, that's why I don't do much of it. Pleasant surprise seeing you at work tonight. You're not usually lurking at the ham, Panther. <laughs> Who's to say I'm not? Well, it was nice seeing you anyway. Lurk, lurk. She's strong, stressed. But you spend a lot of adult hope being vaguely stressed. Aw, dang. I thought the stress would at least get more specific. Oh, no. You'll have that, too. Hmm. So true. Cheer up, kiddo. It's only life. Gee, thanks, Pop. So how about those crawl space boxes? Yeah, okay. I'll move them. TV time? Yeah. And then probably some weird dream, and then I'm going to be done. Great crowd in here tonight. We'd never leave too long, folks. Say Garbo. Yeah, Malloy. Crowds like this remind me of our early days. I disagree. None of them are angry and drunk. Most of them, anyway. No, I mean those old nights, those good nights. Just like the heat of the stage lights. <sighs> and the thrill, thrill of winging, winging it. And the gentle thump of an empty beer bottle thrown at your head. <laughs> These days, things are pretty cushy. You think we're getting soft? You sure are. Turn around the midsection. Or around the... That's a whopper. Malloy, it's company policy to never body shame. Oh, I never worry about that, Garbo. Why is that, Malloy? I'm what you call body shameless. Coming up next, Garbo and I go go to counseling. <laughs> All right, check the old Weberoo. Oh, B's not talking to her now. Oh, there we go. I don't really know how I screwed that up, but I'm sorry. It's fine. I'm going to sleep. See you later. Okay. Hey, kid. Hey, oh. what you up to? Nothing kind of bummed tonight. Why? No reason. Must be going around. I just got into a fight with B. Oh no, about what? I don't even know. I think I'm just an asshole. You and me both. The asshole twins. We can get matching jackets with that on the back. Varsity jackets. With giant asshole patches on the sleeves. Alright, dude. I'm cashing out for the day. See ya, duder. Alright. Excuse me. Alright, what kind of crazy fucking dream do I got tonight? Ooh. 
that's gonna be me in like 10 minutes. Yeah, me too. <laughs> you play that sax. And sax it right up. Yeah, buddy. Ghost sound. I've got one of the four lit. All right. Peanut. She also says, What the heck, mother? Why are you man happy? What the heck? This way. Books in chat. Fancy following for fun? Feel free to flutter and frolic. For follows are furtive and fabulous. Adding flair to flair's channel. Get back up there, fuck. Let me go down to this side and see.
There we go. The platforming itself isn't too bad. It's mostly just about like, like, where did I not go? I think it's this set of buildings over here. Yep. And then I just have to find the crystal thing again. Which was like up top, I think. And then there'll be some kind of weird beast, I imagine. Same as the last two. Yeah, I'm getting real sleepy. Here we go. I gotta <laughs> take Peanut out, and then I'm going to bed too. Yeah. I'm gonna look for raid target once I get to morning here we got like a new chapter title going or what not yet but i was enjoying watching you play and didn't want to miss any yeah this is toy. this is a really interesting game i've been enjoying it too i wasn't quite sure what to expect i just knew that the art style looked cute and uh, the game was like well re re well received I wasn't either. Let's see. It's great. Oh crap, didn't even notice how late it is. Yeah. I got to get to bed. Me too. I'll be on again tomorrow with this. Same time, same place. Let's see. I sleep. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm, let's see. I haven't seen Nikki on in forever. It's one of my older Twitch friends. I don't get to see him play play Maple Story. Why not? Let's do it. Nikki. Oh, and I see QI. D. Buffy. Let's do it. Alright. Let's go say hi to Nikki. I'll see you later. I'll be on tomorrow, 9 Mountain Time. Later, Catnip.